Nice. Welcome to the seventh uh, session of Numenhurst, the Hidden Wish. We're currently in uh, at the end of 39th day of fall, and we are heading to the 40th day of fall, where we're going to have a little bit of a roundup of what you're going to do, because the session is going to take place on the 31st day of fall, where we are going to go to the Maple Festival. Woo! Ooh. Let's go. So, 40 days or 40th day. I don't know how to speak English. Il quarantesimo giorno della di, di autunno. Ho detto you know, in Italia. I have said it in Italian. Yeah, okay. Just, just gave us an idea. Just gave me an idea. They, we should run a one shot where Ken DMs in only Italian. We have to try to comprehend what the fuck he's saying. You know that I can do that if you want. Yeah. I'll just get I'm my dad. I will I will yell at your dad for being for not teaching you Italian. Yes, do that, please. Oh, yeah. I will do that. Okay, so <clears throat> a little bit of a roundup. Uh, we can start with Lu Luna that uh, in the fourth uh, they will spend the fortieth day for the day. Okay, we we'll spent the day mm -hmm. um, preparing, training a little bit, going around. Nothing, nothing too fancy. So Luna did that. Okay, hopefully Lama will come back soon. As for um, the others, we got uh, Avery that just spent the day reading, apparently. Uh, nothing else. And uh, that, that, that that's kind of, a, of an Avery thing to do, to be honest. So, Fuck people. Um, I want to check for something real quick. Hopefully I can find it real quick. Okay, here it is. Uh, let me. <clears throat> so, uh, uh, D and D. I have too many fold. Did the bot die? Yes, it did. I think it's not on loop. Uh, it's not. <laughs> yeah. Well, we'll give the bot some leeway this time, but next time it's gonna be its fault. Right now, I'm the fucking dumbass, as usual. That's not too uncommon an occurrence. Uh, uh. Mm, I'm getting rid of this. Okay. So, <clears throat> going back to what we were saying, uh, Avery spent a day in that way. Then we have uh, Noroi that spent the day by buying new items and mostly resting, considering that his arm is still completely gone. And uh, I would no, he's not gone, but it's not usable. Um, <clears throat> also, we have to keep in mind that this time he's spent <clears throat> quote unquote resting, uh, considering that he has. Uh, his family that just checking on him constantly and going like, you okay? Shubo, you okay? Are you doing, you need anything? Etc. Etc. So that's going to be fun. Uh, as for <clears throat> uh, Sokpo, actually in the day, uh, while doing his stuff, mainly, you know, trading, training and, uh, you know, keeping himself in shape, also uh, went by and, um, and, and said and checked on you, Noroi. That's something that you may perhaps you wanted to know. Checked on you, just making sure that you were doing you were still alive, essentially. So that's something that happened. And um and yeah, and then uh so Paul spent his day working out, keeping in his mind well, let's say busy and venting out his stress. As for um yeah, season 48. 48, I think? It's 48? 49? I forgot myself. Um, it's um, 48, yeah. As for uh, Cedar, Cedar spent his time researching about what the fuck happened. And uh, that this means also that he spent a lot of his time um, in the library trying to understand a little bit more about this migration movements, etc, etc. Uh, this also entices the fact that in the in the past day you have seen a lot of Willow, the, and you got her kind of curious about this intensive research to the point that she are kind of she 
she wasn't too... She, she didn't bother you and your study, but she had to make you go away at some point when the library would close. But she did it in the most polite and respectful way ever, so uh, that's also a plus. Also, if you would like, I would ask you to roll me an investigation check. Let's see what you understood in this study. Watch me roll one. <sighs> that would be fun. He'd love to see it. Come on. Fifteen. Fifteen is a good roll. So, mm, nothing. Rec nothing tells you or, or is even remotely similar to what you have seen. Nothing talks about strength and 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 this this aura and then and whatever that was. You have no idea about that, but you have seen the records. And uh, the past few years, some strange behavior have been seen, mainly about animals and other creatures migrating from their places. This happened mainly with the uh, with the forest, with the Earthwood, with the uh, Nimena Swamp. There has been a lot of ruckus in the Stone Belt as well. In short, there has been a lot of movement. Mm, perhaps though, they are not the same kind of pattern. Some of these creatures have been moved and 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 uh, and migrated. You could say because of some kind of um, uh, of some kind of unnatural behavior, while some other animals have been recorded to be to move because of the increasing of the population and and and, and beginning of the of the villages and settlements. So, why is this pattern like this? It's still kind of unclear, but you have seen a little bit of this pattern around. So, that's suspicious. Very suspicious. That's one thing that you can say, at least. And with that being said, I would say that <clears throat> the 40th day, 40, 40th, il quarantesimo giorno di, di, di autunno, uh, ends in um, <gasps> ends in quite a peaceful way. Uh, yes. Uh, and in uh, with you resting, taking your time to study and then go around and check what's going on, etc, etc. Well, as for the 41st day, there's one thing that we have to do before we start that day. And that's the fact that the 40th day, 41st day, Uh, underlines the beginning of a new week. And you know what that means? Fucking... Oh. You gotta pay. Oh, baby. So, everyone was staying at the, um, at the Stout Hawk has to pay four gold pieces in advance for the various expenses that they're going to make. Those who don't stay at the Stout Oak for the week as this pay, tr pay three gold. Fuck is... Fuck is Leroy buying? <laughs> well, the food that they eat at home, for example. Yeah. Leroy seems like the type of kid who would pitch in with money, so it makes sense. I eat pie. Oh, he's not like the type of, uh, of kid that would pitch in money. Kijo is, is calling him if he doesn't. <laughs> he is, you're a grown man, why are you still living with us? Or something. <laughs> okay, let me grab her. Uh, she appreciates your company. She wants you to be there with family. Sorry, sorry. Your mom is not young either. <clears throat> I remember my family. <laughs> Lama old, yes. My family's fucking dead. 
hell. Is it? I is it not? I shouldn't be laughing at that. Oh. <sighs> the rock eyebrow raise. Vine. <laughs> Wait a minute. Should I, should I change the music? And, uh, we can change it in a moment. Okay. So, uh, it's the 41st day. You guys wake up. So, uh, who's waking up first? Roll me a D, uh, you know what? Let's roll a D4. Oh, you got it. Uh, roll D4. Boom. First, Cedar. Oh baby, you woke, wake up. Step in a bear trap. And I will Step tell you that you wake up and have a, a serene day with no clouds. Finally, it's not particularly mm. sunny outside, but you can see that it's quite pleasant still. Very pleasant. I still don't like it. <laughs> Too much light. <laughs> so, what's your ideal weather? N nothing. <laughs> nothing. This void. Moonlight. Moonlight. Keep me for the for last. Okay. Uh. So you wake up and you know that you have. I have noise around me. I love how you call your mom noise. I <laughs> tell her I say hi. And um it's her name now. Yes. Bastard, I am. And you are as well. And you love me anyway. Anyway. Uh Cedar. You wake up and um Yeah, so it's kinda kinda serene outside, quite pleasant. You know that you have decided all together to go to this Maple Festival, not too far from there, the, the, at Saturn. And at this point, you kind of see that it's not even too early. It's like 9 a.m., so it's it's a, it's, a, it's a good hour, you know, to wake up and, and start a new, fresh day. Uh, yeah, you're, still a you're still a little bit dizzy with the amount of studying you have done the day before, but you're okay. Brain is fried. <laughs> we ever agree on where we would meet before going to the festival? As always, no. <laughs> Amazing. Uh, when I take up my bear trap, I guess. Um, man, I did not come up with a plan for what I would do today. Like 9 a.m. I think I'll just go to the gate that's nearest to the road towards Satin. Okay. After eating breakfast and whatnot. Yeah, you go down. You you manage to um to meet the there is uh, LC and Wilmer. They're all doing their stuff. They or they give you the breakfast you prefer. What would you like to eat for breakfast? You're not here anymore. Stale bread. Still bread. They give you still bread, and Elsie gives you a little bit extra because still bread sounds sad, so they give you also a little bit of less stale bread. Nice. And you get your breakfast, and it's Smile at Elsie. invigorating. Elsie smiles back and goes back to work. She seems to be particularly busy. And you can see that this morning there are a quite of quite amount of people around. They seem to be chit chatting about the festival as well. <laughs> Do I see any of my party in here? Not yet. For once I'm the first awake. Or perhaps the last. Or last. Hmm. 
I would say that you see uh, Luna that is mindlessly eating their, her, uh, her breakfast as well. Since, you know... Looks we like she's still live. on drugs. Wait, Lama, I'm gonna use this moment to make her into a puppet. <laughs> There's an Elden Ring reference. Anyway. <clears throat> I think the idea that Luna has just been on drugs for two days. You can see Luna is, uh, has been training a lot, has been focusing a lot, but perhaps with all the fight, with all that is going on in the past few days, she she looks like she's spacing out a little bit. But she's she tells you good morning, and you can see that she's eating her breakfast as well, and then she's gonna follow you uh, when you're going to the to the gate Eight. or whatever. Yeah, you know, go to the at south gate, I guess. Yes, that would be the one closer to to Saturn, indeed. Yeah. Okay. So, you go towards that direction. Uh, Silpo. Fuzzy man. Hello. What you wake up. It's uh, I, I would say it's about nine a.m. But if you can, you, you can tell me if you wanted to wake up earlier. No, I don't think. I I think it's just it's a relaxing day. It's probably gonna sleep in a little bit and yeah. nine. Um, he is going to just you know stretch out a little bit, warm up, and then go downstairs to get some breakfast. Okay. You get down, you can see Wilmer and Elsie working hard. You can, you can swear to you if you have seen, you, you've just noticed um, uh, Luna and, and Cedar exiting the moment you go down, but perhaps it was just your imagination. Starting dates. I'm just gonna get some food and. Um... What would you like to eat? Rice and chicken. Rice and chicken. Mm, that's, some good shit. that's a that's a that's a hell of a breakfast. I don't know about. I mean, he is a fox, and he's a makes barbarian. sense. <laughs> makes sense. Yeah. Uh, Elsie looks at you a little bit confused, but then goes like right away, and she comes back after a couple of minutes with a big plate of rice and chicken. Thank you. You're welcome. Jesus. And she goes to speed run work because there are a lot of people. He is going to very much enjoy this meal. Yeah. Meat. Meat. But anyway. Uh, but that's done. Is... Where was the festival happening again? Saturn. Saturn. All right. South then... of uh, Nomenhurst. And theoretically mm -hmm. speaking, uh, he... You should be going with Noroi and his family? Question mark? Question mark. Oh, um, that, is, that was the plan. He did invite us before he got his arm broken. So, best course of action, gonna go to him. Yeah. Yeah. So, right. you're taking your time to go towards Noroi's house. The fuck you're doing here? Go here. You're going towards Noroi's house, and I would say that Noroi... Noroi, you woke up earlier, I guess. Yeah. And uh, you tried to go out to jog, and your mom gatekeep you from doing <laughs> that. And you said, go back to sleep, bitch. And you wait, go back to sleep. So you, it's now 9 a.m. and you're on the bed. Well, I probably couldn't sleep, but I was just in the bed. Yeah. Um... Staring at the ceiling. I expect yeah. Martha to say something like your boss gatekeep or something. No, he didn't. <laughs> okay. But I'd probably go out to help with uh, making breakfast. Okay. You you can help with just you you can literally give just one hand, but <laughs> uh, uh, you you're giving you're giving some help. Your dad and mom are appreciative of it, but also very worried about you. 
and they also told you that if you if they if you prefer you can stay at home and if you prefer they can stay at home with you to just to check on you if you if there's any any need unless you want to go to the festival oh i think going to the festival is better and your mom agrees with you he just says that yeah i mean Taking your mind a little bit off this whole situation and enjoying a little bit of time, especially since you invited your uh, your 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 companions, it would be. I think it's a it's a good uh, it's a good thing for your head, at least. Mm -hmm. And your dad agrees with your mom. Now, the odd one out. <laughs> the fuck is Avery doing? Oh well, she's just gonna be. She's gonna wake up. Uh... be antsy because well there's no work today so no money yep so she's kind of mad about that i'm just gonna sit there and read a book i guess okay maybe wait for someone to come up to say hey you want breakfast but if they don't she's not gonna eat okay well, they're not kind of busy today, so they're probably gonna come later. Yeah. Uh, okay. When, when exactly is the festival? It's going to be it's basically the whole the whole day. It's basically the whole day, and it's gonna be this celebration. Actually, you can roll me a history check if you want to know more about the Maple uh, Festival. If you if you know anything about it, if you perhaps read about it. Right, well, let me... <clears throat> me up her sheet. I should have had this open from the get go. That's my bad. History. Oh, okay, we good at history. <sighs> I'm sorry. 24. Yeah, you know nice. shit. You've probably read a lot about it, per perhaps. For what is your understanding, this is gonna be the 347th Maple Festival. It's quite a historical uh, thing. And uh, it's essentially this festival that is meant to celebrate the fact that now that you are in the depth of fall, uh, the trees are getting red and red. And um, the... It's basically a celebration of the mid-autumn, essentially. Okay. And for that, for this reason, there is a lot of eating. There is a lot of of uh, enjoying time all together, and the, the people from other villages and cities are also invited. Usually, one thing that happened in this festival is that they uh, basically set up the the main uh, square, the main the, the, the center of the city, with tables and stuff and. And, and like a group of people that have been uh, that, that you know, basically choose to help for this uh, for this festival will cook and prepare a lot of different stuff, especially the stuff that is typical of the place, and will serve food for anyone that wants to eat and enjoy some some something to something nice. And they're going to make basically giant tables with with a lot of people all together so that everyone can socialize everyone can spend a little bit of time together and basically enjoyin a company as soon they're going to face uh, the cold of winter and so what's the best way to fight the cold of winter the warmth of company that's kind of the message Avery is like, and um, fuck company i warm myself with books and uh, of course, uh, among the food and, uh, and drinking and people cheering, there are going to probably be a couple of stands of people selling stuff. There are probably going to be uh, wandering merchants that are going to use this occasion to show their goods. Probably a couple of games that maybe perhaps you can, you can play and stuff like that. Uh, classic festival, not too big, not too small, you know. That's the kind of history of it. He's just gonna sit there and think about it for a bit. She doesn't want to bother the rest of them. So 
she'll just stay here. Mm hmm. Reading books all day because she's a fucking nerd. Okay. You nerd. So. So, Paul, you find yourself at the front of Noroi's house. He's, uh, he's a little worried since, you know, last time he kind of saw Noroi get his arm broken. Yeah. But not, it, he not knows he's a tough nut, you know, it's just, it, it's fine, right? Yeah. Um, I mean, you broke your own arms at multiple times, you're fine, so whatever. Very much. <laughs> it was not that bad. Yeah, your mom once broke your arms as well, so... <laughs> what? She was just having fun. It was yeah. just rough housing. It's just what training with it's, barbarians. It's, it's a training session, what you mean? It's yeah. just normal. If you break your bones, they just grow stronger. I don't think it doesn't work like that. I think it actually it's not just how like it that. works for barbarians. Yeah, yeah, but depending on how you break bones, it's, it's gonna be a little bit problematic. Yeah, it depends on how you break bones. <laughs> Built different. Man, you know what, what one, one bone that you can break to grow stronger? Yeah? Is the one of your neck. If you break the bone of your neck, you grow stronger in the next mm -hmm. life. Yeah. It's... But in the next life. Yeah, perfect. He's gonna do it. No. No, no, no. Silk Paw is undead. <laughs> the thing is, he's dumb enough. And, um, yeah. So, what you doing there? Yeah. Uh, he is going to just take a minute to take a deep breath, you know? He's still yeah. kind of shaken from last battle, but it, it, it's fine. It's, I think he's gonna be fine. And he is going yeah. to knock, you know, just... Knock oh. on the door. Knock, yeah, knock. I got, I got knock noises. There you go. Perfect. Immersive. Okay. And you are welcomed by William. Hello. Hello. Is uh, Mr. Nor uh, Dubo here? <laughs> and uh, he goes like, "Oh, you must be one of um of Shubu's um, companions, friends of yes. uh, and comrades, let's say. Uh, That's please great. come in." Thank you. You are his uh, father, I assume? I am, yes. I may look like his grandfather, but I am actually his father, <laughs> yes. Ah, I just heard he that smiles. you are... <laughs> Sokpa is smiling this entire interaction. Um... Sokpa is just all okay. Yes, but a little insane. Mm. Uh... <laughs> ah! Uh, I heard that you know a little bit about magic. I do. Yes, I am. I used to be quite, quite a prodigal sorcerer, you could say, a magician. But now I, may, I mostly spend my time teaching to those who still not have the expertise to control their powers. Then, uh, if you don't mind, I would like to ask you about mine. Huh? Do you have? some kind of uh, magical power within you? Yes, I just can't control it. Huh. Hmm. Well, magical powers sometimes are... Um, how to say it? They can be pe very peculiar. Some are meant to be controlled. Some other are not meant to be controlled. It's not unusual to have powers that are, <clears throat> you could say, a little bit wild. Uh, but here's the thing. One thing is being able to control a power properly and and make it behave like you want. One thing is about is knowing that your power cannot be controlled and uh, letting it flow without disrupting yourself or, the, or, or those around you. And, uh, and another thing, again, is having a power that cannot be controlled and not keeping it in check. That's problematic. So, uh, if you find yourself in a situation when 
you do you make damage while not ma while not wanting or causing effects that you really feel like you are are not those that you would like to make then it means that your magic is acting in ways that are outside of your will and that's problematic something like that already happened twice huh. well i would say that that's problematic anyway i am this today i'm not like entirely oh no i mean don't get me wrong i'm I have most of my days are free, but today I was planning with my family to go to the to the Maple Festival, and to my knowledge, I think you're also coming, right? Yep, that Achuba. is why I'm here, actually. Yeah, I mean, you can always come by another of these days, and we can talk more about your magic. You don't have to worry. We can talk about it uh, in that uh, in that occasion. Oh, and okay. considering that you. Or um, uh, a friend of Shubo, I would say that at least for the first uh, for the first lesson, if it's gonna be required, I will it will be on the house. Oh, that's very nice of you. I uh, might more or less come to terms with the fact that I can't really control this much, but I'll I'll drop by. Yeah. Anyway, here, let me let me. Well, follow me, and he basically brings you to the other room where uh, you guys are eating breakfast, and uh, and and Kiju is essentially mocking you, asking you if she has to uh, feed you herself. <laughs> I can eat. Bruh. Are you sure? Yes. You know, I am. when you were a Don't small baby, you used to feed Lama! yourself. Lama yes, back. Lama. That is what happens with babies. Hello. Well, you, um, you look Lama. like one, to me at least. You don't look older. I would say that I look younger. Thanks. <laughs> and she, she's kind of proud of that. Well, if you look younger, then I should feed you, right? She looks at you smirking. Do it. Okay. <laughs> and at this point, Silpo <laughs> enters and sees this conversation. <laughs> uh, um. Oh, hi! You're one of the Shubo's friends. I love hi. these two's relationship, what the heck? Mr. Shinkazer, um, good morning. Morning! Did I come at a bad time? No, you didn't. I was just making fun of my son. Uh, here, uh, would you like some breakfast? Have you ate already? Thank you, I did eat. I ate a hearty breakfast. Nice. Well, uh... Bread. We were planning, as I said, to, to go towards the... Um, to a satin for the festival and we're probably going there quite soon also you don't have to worry we're probably going to me and william are going to probably take our time alone so we will leave you we'll leave shubo in your care would you like would you would you mind absolutely not okay. friends are supposed to take care of each other indeed indeed i'm glad that shubo's making friends it's not really good with it with that um <clears throat> anyway wow. what Am I wrong? He has a point. No. You're not wrong. Of course, I'm never wrong. What do you mean? <clears throat> anyway. Uh, so yeah, uh, just give me a little bit of time and we're going to be able, we'll, we'll be free to go. Absolutely. Take all the time you need. Okay. Well, uh, this, uh, this mess is happening. Uh... Let me give you a round up of what's going on, uh, Lama. Uh, you woke up, you went to have breakfast, and you followed Cedar at the southern gate of um, of Numenor's towards Saturn, waiting for the others because you didn't really remember if there was going to be a place to where everyone should meet. 
considering that you were not here, I made Luna be essentially absent-minded, and so you follow, you simply followed Cedar. Now, if you would like to talk or say anything Snap. or do anything, feel free to do it. Snap in front of Luna's eyes. Oi, how many drugs Ooh, have you taken? What? Oh, uh, none, sir. Uh, you sure? Sorry. You've been yeah, real weird. I I drank a lot last night. I'm just zoning out. Hmm. I could probably find a herb to help with that. Or not. It's fine. Hmm. You sure you didn't take meth? <laughs> no, I'm I'm sure. Hold on, what even is meth? How do I know what that is? Anyways. <laughs> I don't know what to talk about. Just kind of look around awkwardly. Cedar stares at you unblinkingly, like always. 50% of his interactions oh. is just awkward silence. We love to see the, it. How's the... How's the... Weather been? How's your? I don't. I don't know what to ask about. Um, I like there are, that there aren't clouds. I wish the sun wasn't so bright. Well, the sound is not bright, as I as I told you. I guess it, you can any sound any sun for you is bright, but any sun is just so much for cedar. Can't the skin it. is so pale; it's practically <laughs> white. Yeah. Uh, I like. I prefer to be a bit more sunny myself. But... Oh, by the way, uh, Luna, uh, since it's n it's today, it's a new week, so you have to spend four gold coins for every sp expense in in terms of housing and food. I already told to the others. I'm gonna tell to you <coughs> too as well. Okay, let me find my character sheet so I can. Benji. Sorry. Please. Ah, I'm I'm alive. That's good. Make sure to spend fifty gold for that deal you made with Walter White. What? I'm I'm rewatching I'm rewatching Breaking Bad, so this is perfect. Ken just makes meth and Walter White can Breaking Bad. Yes. There's a flower meth already. Yeah. But his name would be Walter. Black. It's uh it's the blue sky lily. <laughs> the blue man. Anyway. <clears throat> While you're all coolly chit chatting, uh you can see uh a wagon where uh on, on top of the wagon trained by horses, this one is actually trained by horses. Uh, there are uh, William and Kijon Roy, and from the inside you can see the silent chit-chatting. Uh, so very, very quiet and very chill, chill uh, presence of these two people. That they uh, go Ooh. towards the gate, expecting you to, at this point to find you directly in Saturn since you were not there <laughs> at Anna Roy's house. Luna completely sighs in relief and <laughs> walks over. Oh, you oh, hello, you two! And Kijo starts going. Oh, we were I expecting you to be to to come to our house as well. <coughs> only only Sopo came. We oh. literally never set a meeting place. Yeah, I. I guess I just that's follow, so. I just followed Cedar around. I. I stare at her. Yeah. Sir Luna. I mean, I thought I thought Shuba would have told you. I guess it's Shuba's fault after all. Uh, yeah. Anyway. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> kind of just yes. like Shubo. Shubo. It's, it's, it's classic mom behavior to always put the the, the, the fault on her children. True. <laughs> And, uh, well, uh, if you want to come with, just just get up, unless you want to make it by walking. It's going to be a little bit tiring, uh, though. Yeah, my legs probably are 
a bit too old for that. Uh, oh, you look young old. enough. How old are you? 20? 19? Uh, how old are you? Uh, I'm in, I'm in my 30s. You're in your 30s? For a second there, I thought you were going to say you're also 48. <laughs> I mean... Well, Man, for what it matters, I am young. Like... I am much older than you, so. Yeah. And you look a lot younger than me. So that what makes that feel what? Like... Well, <laughs> that's a, let's ca let's call it a secret. In. Secret of my family, let's say it. Anyway, come up. <coughs> Get aboard. <laughs> you all... And you it. see okay, inside... Then. You see inside these two guys. You're now all four reunited. And she's just here. <laughs> yeah. I'm new I feel like we're missing one. But I can't remember. If you don't remember, it means that he's not important. <laughs> yeah. True. Didn't she say that she didn't want to come? Yeah, I'm not sure a festival sounds like anything she'd be interested in. We'll probably her, find her at the uh, library when we're back. Yeah. Mm. She'll be fine. I doubt she'll get into much trouble. I that do worry point. about she's... her a little bit, but... Uh, she's an adult. She can handle herself. No. You <laughs> No, no, she can't. Well, she's fine on her own. <laughs> Wasn't she on her own? She was on her own a few weeks ago before we uh, kinda got together, so. I mean. I don't think she needs anybody to take care of herself. She is plenty capable in a combat situation, but. Would be incapable of asking for food. Yes, that know. is what I was worried about. Well, I think <coughs> holding herself up like that is just just makes her situation worse. We'll, we'll be back before before she notices, probably anyway. It's fine. Mm, hopefully. Just try not to worry. We're going to a festival. Let's have fun. I'm always worrying. Just buy her something that when we're sense. back. I just pets. You can keep talking. Pat me. Just on your back. Mm. Cedar, sh uh, Cedar goes rigid for a second before relaxing. You know, I sometimes wonder okay. if you are touch-starved or fearful, fearful of it. Both. Probably both. Yes. Yes. <laughs> that okay. is information I'm not willing to share. So... Understandable. You have a quite peaceful stroll in the in the southern road of um, Numenhurst, towards the uh, the road that goes towards Saturn, at least, also known as the Port Street, considering that it also the same road that at some point will join with um, Port Albius, one of the biggest cities of Numenhurst, technically the third biggest. But considering that the second is it doesn't exist anymore, it's now the second. <clears throat> anyway. Um, as we <laughs> You you walk through the basically this this beautiful scenery of, of fields and grass and, and prayers. It's it's quite quite relaxing, I would say. 
Every one of you feels a little bit vented out of the stress of the past few days with all this fighting and and and, and, and quests and, and thinking all about survival and, and all those things that surely leave a little bit of a mark on you in one way or another. And, uh, you know, getting a little bit of time to just take your mind off the situation. It's always appreciated, you know, in one way or another, again. Uh, I, uh, as you continue going towards the, towards Saturn, you can start to see the, the relatively small village. Uh, and you can see in the, on the road that a lot of people working there. Young, old, adults, kids, families, everything, kind, every kind of people. Does not seem seem to be too much. It's it's still like something local, something that uh, is not gonna make people from another continent come here, or like the the, the, the farthest farthest city from here going there. But still, people can be interested in this kind of occasions, and uh, and this is uh, this seems to be quite a, quite a pleasant occasion to just have a trip and like take a day off. And uh, and as you reach there, you see what is ex essentially uh, a town that is busy with people having fun. You can see in the center. I I I was planning on making a proper map for this for 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 the, for the festival, but since I wasn't completely satisfied, I decided to just use an image. Uh, you will have a map of of Saturn one day, but uh, it's, it's it's Fire Emblem's fault. Um, uh, as you reach there, you can see this this town filled with 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 people having fun and talking with each other, and and you can see that in the center of the city there has been set up a, 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 a basically this long gas table, all with sits. What 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 is that K? What is that K, Arthur? The fuck you want? Uh, long ass table with old seats and 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 people uh, preparing food and people that are already drinking. Considering that at this point, since Saturn is not really next, around the corner, I you have to keep in mind that Saturn. It's where, where is the map? Where, where is the actual map? Okay, here. Saturn's it's it's a little bit further away than than Dorenborg. It's gonna require a couple of hours to go there. On foot it would have been more, but uh, it's it's a pleasant stroll, uh, especially because uh, you also have the company of Kija that doesn't stop talking for some reason, unlike his, her son. Um, and uh, and when you reach here, it's about I would say noon, and you can see this uh, very lively scenery as you reach there. Uh, Kijo. Um, and William uh, talk for a little bit, and William then managed to uh, talk with a passerby in order to try and get a place where to put the the wagon so that they can uh, safely go back uh, go back with it. Uh, they they go down and they just check on you from be uh, uh, there you are behind. So uh, if you want to get down, you can uh, you can go around in the city. Just make sure to be careful. We're probably gonna stay here for for a while. If you if you want to to go back earlier, if you want to stay more, you can always come back or ask for another kind of uh, of uh, of way to come back earlier. You know, asking around probably people from the capital that would be uh, okay to give you um, to help you come go back to the capital. But otherwise, we're probably gonna stay just uh, just the afternoon, the, the day, the, the, this a couple of hours. That's in, in maybe coming back in the afternoon or early evening. If if anything, you're gonna see us around. So uh, feel free to enjoy yourself in this uh, in this festival. And Shubo, please mm -hmm. just just get your mind off work, get your mind off adventure. Just just relax, okay? I'll try. And Kijo looks at all three of you. Make sure to 
that 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 he doesn't get hurt, it doesn't do anything strange, okay? Yep. So Paul's just gonna salute her like, yes, ma'am. I feel like okay. the opposite would happen given our track record, but all right. <clears throat> he can be a little bit stern, but I don't. Know, I just wish you just wish you would, you know, get a little bit. Enjoy a little bit more of other things besides work, essentially. Anything, anyway, uh, we're gonna make sure to to park the uh, the wagon and uh, you can go around already and uh, if you want to have a stroll or anything, okay? All right. Mm -hmm. With Not that being here. said, they are <coughs> gone. Here. I'm gonna get up and stretch my arms and hop out. Okay. I'm going out to. What was there to do here? Festival stuff. Festival? Yeah. It's meant to be a place where you can have fun, you can drink, you can eat, perhaps you can buy something, you know, just Ooh. stroll around. Here's the funny. Do you have something to do? Not really. Do you want to do anything? It's up to you. Hmm. Let's just walk around for now for now Came and see what's food. interesting. Yeah. I... You they walk around like... and then uh... Oh yeah, I think so... they have like games or something that we can play. Or maybe know. fun fights. Hmm. Yeah, I'd love like, to get a hit fight. Like a... I'd love to get like a... a toy or something from one of the shops. A medieval roller coaster. And send it back to my family. Yeah, we also need to buy something for Avery. Yeah, definitely. Oh, Avery even bought. <laughs> Maybe some kind of book. You st st stroll around a little bit in the in the city, and you can see that there are a lot of people, and most of them are uh, enjoying the food at the central table, where you can see a lot of a, a lot of cooks and a lot of, of maids and, 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 and you know just people serving food, all things that seems to be uh, very uh, local in terms of ingredients. Mm -hmm. You can also see a couple of what it seems to be... Um, I want to kill the bot so badly. Oh. Uh, I want to kill Codex badly, so we are <laughs> in the same boat. Uh, you are. Um, you also see a couple of stands, basically, where you can see a couple of, uh, of trinkets or the likes related to the Maple Festival. Mm. Smells good. The smell is amazing. Mm -hmm. Everything here looks tasty and, and enjoyable, essentially. Yeah. Anything sweet, like pastries? Uh, there are a couple of sweet things, but it's yeah. there's a lot of choice. <laughs> mm. And and one of them, <laughs> one of the stands, also seems to sell typical uh, sweets. Could I go look uh, look at like the trinkets stands and stuff like that yeah. just see what they got okay i can tell you that uh, there are a couple of stands that sell uh, essentially things that are really mm, mm, really about the festival so nothing uh n nothing uh let's say unrelated to the festival but there are a couple of stands that also sell things that are unrelated to the festival one thing that you can see for sure uh, is that there are a lot of people that are selling uh these uh decorations and small trinkets and necklaces and stuff like that where with them um, essentially this this maple tree logo with the 347th Written 347th Maple Festival, etc., etc., you know, celebration kind of thing. Uh, I see. Um, uh, Maple <clears throat> Festival is like a harvest festival, right? Sorry? It's like, it's celebrating like harvest, I think. 
I forgot what it's about. And it's about uh, I told already before uh, when I was explaining, but uh, it's essentially about uh, the um, reaching the higher uh, the, 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 the 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 clue part, the the central part of fall, and having all the trees turning red, and essentially celebrating the, the fall before the coming of winter. Uh, okay. Do I see any like? At like the, I guess souvenir, yes, shop-ish area. It's, like there is are there any kind of, uh, like toys or plushes. Uh, yes, I would say so. Yes, I'd like to just take a look for something like that. Okay. Uh, looking around, you can see that there are. Mm, there are not really uh, a lot of plushes or stuff like that, but toys and, and others decorate decoration that look cute enough there are. For instance, there are like small statues of maple trees with all the with all the right writing of um, Maple Festival, or there are classic toys that are rebranded in a way and, and, and a little bit made for uh, for the maple like to, to look a little bit more maple festival-ish. For example, spinning tops and stuff like that, uh, you can find those. Also, you can find one specific thing that is very about, very very unique about this festival, uh, and those things are actually two. One is the maples; uh, is what they they are uh, they call as the maple snack, and it's essentially essentially uh, a, 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 a a sweet thing that is uh, made by a lot of uh, stools here. Uh, stands here. And another thing is what they call the Lucky Leaf. Mm -hmm. uh, you can see in one of the stands this, what it seems to be a maple leaf, but is essentially, it's, it looks like it's crystallized. Ooh. Ooh. And uh, and you don't really know much about it, and if you want, you can always ask to the owner of the stand. Uh, yeah, I'll I'm go on. to the owner and, uh... Um, uh, hey there, uh... I Peter wanted to too. know about this, uh, lucky, uh, leaf thing. Oh, we got lucky leaf, yes, yes! Uh, this is <coughs> quite something that we do a lot. It's, um, it's quite special. Uh, you see... This is a maple leaf that has been crystallized with a special project, pro process that uses a couple of, sub of substances, a little bit of magic, and mostly maple um, uh, maple sap. But here's the thing. 99% of the times, the life breaks in this process. So when it's uh, intact like this, it means that it's very lucky. That's why we call it Ooh. Lucky Leaf. Really this weird. item has an hidden function. I will tell you, as uh, gameplay-wise, as DM, this item has a hidden effect. Ooh. You would like to, uh, to buy one? Hmm, uh, how much does this, uh, cost? Yeah, I mean, I know that the price can be a little bit intimidating, considering that it's just a leaf, it's decoration, but uh, there is a lot of superstition about it, and the process is really hard to us. So it's five gold pieces for each. Ooh. That's pricey, huh? Um... Hmm... There's nothing better to remind yourself of the Maple Festival you came to see, besides, uh, well, a lucky leaf. Um, I'll, uh, I'll hold off on buying one for now, but I'm interested. I might come back, uh, Absolutely. Later. We are here. Not do him. Uh, I then, I also just, like, uh... And I'll money. grab, like, 
I'll grab like a try to find like an interesting looking toy. Yeah. Uh, uh, from behind Luna, and I buy the maple leaf, the lucky leaf. You buy it? Yeah. Okay. Uh, so five. I just like pieces. try to find some sort of like just vaguely interesting toy, like anything that's not like super boring. Yeah, I mean, you can find uh, a variety of them. Pretty much of all types. All decorated with maybe etchings or carving related to the maple festivals and stuff mm. like that. They have a yo-yo? Uh, they do have something similar, yes. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna buy a yo-yo. Okay, it's gonna be... Oh uh, it's gonna be one silver piece. Okay, I can afford that. Uh... This is the Maple Festival, so there's got to be like just full bottles of maple syrup somewhere, right? Yes. Perfect. How much do they cost? <laughs> they cost depends on the quality. They have it of different kind of quality, different kind of sweetness. It's uh, like the cheaper, the cheapest goes for like. Small bottles of eight copper pieces. Uh, then you have like the medium one that are really that are really nice. You know the classic maple syrup. I would say they would be like two silver pieces, maybe four silver pieces, depending on on how big they you want them. But there's also like the extra special, classic, mega good, extremely tasty maple syrup that can go up to five gold pieces, ten gold pieces a bottle. <sighs> ah, wow. I like the idea of Cedar, like, trying to hide the fact that he really likes sweet food. <laughs> Got his little syrup bottle. Trying to save my money for equipment, but I really want to buy the super expensive syrup. <laughs> uh, uh. Okay, in, 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 considering that you sent me that message uh, in DMs, roll me a perception check. Okay. Oh gosh. You do look and, and, and notice that there is someone that looks strange. It looks yeah. like it's a little bit panicking, perhaps. Like, very, very not feeling great about the situation. I'll go approach that person. Okay. We know and you see... Shubo being... Uh... You see a girl that... It's like elf, 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 you can truly tell immediately. And it looks a little bit like uh, it's trying to look around, maybe look around. You don't really get if it's looking around for something or it's just not particularly enjoying something. You, you don't really know. It's this girl. Excuse me? Is everything all right? Um, yeah, everything is um, fine. What? Hmm? What? You seem to be panicking. <laughs> oh, um, yeah, I'm just kind of not used to this Wait. situation. I see. Well, if there's any way I can help you, tell me. Uh, I'm having an aneurysm. Okay, um, Shubo, roll me an inside with disadvantage. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh. Oh, oh my god. Well, <laughs> it's up to you, Red. 
it's it's up to you, Retro. Freaking expertise. Okay, well... <laughs> the mannerisms are the exact same as Avery, just on a different body. So Perhaps he just looks familiar. It reminds you of her, but... you Have I... seen you before? Deception. <laughs> Do I? I don't. I don't have. I don't have that. I don't have deception. I'm a bad. I'm a bad changeling. <laughs> Can I roll insight against that? Oh, uh, uh, we'll see. We'll see. Okay. Let's see. My my deception. Is, this is Not wrong. the changelings okay. get. Okay, there's something I will say about Codex. Why can't they just have everything in one place? Why is it on different tabs? Because Codex is fucking bad. It's not bad. It's, eh. it's just... Where are you rolling? Okay, yeah, you're rolling here. Okay, that's oh, 16. Bad. 16 is good. Uh, <clears throat> well. I will tell you that... This person looks more and more suspicious. Are you sure we haven't met before? Completely sure. She nods, yeah. <laughs> you get a stress point. <laughs> Fuck yeah! <laughs> yeah, baby! Do we... Did we notice the Roy wander off? Now, now you notice. It's not too far away. It's, 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 it's a little bit behind you. I love it. Also, you, you, can, uh, you can write down in your, uh, in your inventory Lucky I Leaf. I always notice. Um, name is Lisa Goldleaf. Is it now? I'm gonna, I'm gonna walk over to Sh Shubo. I'm busy agonizing over uh, prices of Shubo, are syrup. You, you, you do it? Uh, hi, ma'am. Shubo, <laughs> stop bothering random people. No. You... <laughs> Look at her. <laughs> what? She looks She's like a random a girl. Doesn't she look familiar to you? Um, no. <laughs> I'm not I'm... even checking. Luna is as dumb as a brick. <laughs> she does not. <laughs> so fun gonna come to these fucking... I'm... I... Hey! Oh, What's goodness. the fuss about? Shubo's... I'm, I'm just... Shubo... Okay, I'll... Shubo... I'll buy it, I'll come over. I know that... Like, I know you... I know you're, like, suspicious of people often. But she's just some lady enjoying the festival. I think you should... No, that's... What? I'm... I'm sure I'm right. There, there's something she's not telling me. <laughs> All right, come she over. doesn't have to tell you her life story. No, I'm not talking about that. Shubo, man of many wives. Are you seducing someone? No. <laughs> Don't say that. I'm just, uh, I just kind of roll my eyes and pat Shubo on the shoulder. Have fun with your stuff. I'm gonna walk back to the stand. I thought I was the one that Man, bothered. Look me in the girls. eyes. <laughs> do I have to roll something to do God. that? Uh, you can just tell me if you, mm. you can or cannot. Considering or if you force yourself to do just it. Gave me. Mm. She's scared of him. <laughs> She'll do it. Now tell me again. Have we met before? She nods. She shakes her head. No, she doesn't nod. <laughs> you can insight with advantage. Okay. <laughs> Avery's a bad Body guy. language is too clear. Yeah. Okay. The worst I can roll is 15 anyway. <laughs> oh my god. That's Why 15. You like 15. <laughs> well. <laughs> Um, 
Okay, here's what you get. You are sure that she's not telling the truth. But you also feel that it's not lying to you. It's more like she's not telling you tru the truth for a reason. But not in, 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 in a negative way kind of thing. She doesn't look guilty of anything. She doesn't feel guilty of anything. Sorry. How about we go somewhere private and then maybe you can tell me. Is it hitting off the gun? <laughs> I stare at Neroi. I'm gonna... The, the, you gotta respect the, his game. You gotta respect his game. game. I'm... okay. Just gonna Normally, whisper. I'm the one that sounds sucks. <laughs> I gotta come by hey, I, uh, and, and talks with you, uh, um, girl, and goes like, Are these men in put, like, harassing you, ma'am? <laughs> I'm gonna... I'm seeing... Uh, you guard. know what? Yes, it's gonna happen. <laughs> Wait. I'm gonna, I'm gonna I'm... walk over. A book it. Uh, oh, oh gosh. That's... Oh, I'm, wait, can I cut? Can I try to grab? <laughs> See the guard coming, I'm gone. Okay. <laughs> okay. No, I'm that's leaving. so suspicious! <laughs> oh god! <laughs> they have game! I'm gonna. I'm just gonna go over. Uh, okay. Can I, gosh, I'm. Can I, can I stop Luna uh, from interrupting him? Officer, sir, I'm so sorry for my. He's. He's he's not well. <laughs> oh, wait a second! Damn it, we made a. Are you serious? We made a... You're he's socially awkward. I turned. I turned to you. I'm just trying to get you out of this shit. Please, ma'am. Don't make this harder than it has to be. I can't remember, I made a promise to make sure Shubo doesn't get in trouble. I come yeah. back. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I love this. Yeah, same. Uh, she's gonna look between the guard, look at Shubo oh God. in between the guard. Things. I'm gonna oh. run away. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, God. I get Absolutely. anything <laughs> I from run what after is her. happening. <laughs> you run after? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm going to grab <laughs> Roy. Okay. Okay. Anyone who wants to try and stop Noroi, you can roll me uh, uh, an athletics check. Oh. Contested okay. with his acrobatics. Okay. All right. Let's, great let's, go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. It. No. 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 <laughs> Oh, <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> it's okay. You did it already. <laughs> this situation is amazing. I love it so much. Okay, can I just try my best not to like hurt him with his arm? Don't break his arm. Grab, grab him by the neck. It'll make him stronger. Just, look, just hug like, him. I just um, kind of like try to grab his like shoulder and like stop him. Just hug him from behind. Just, come on. Shubo. I have, I have to look around. Shubo, I How know much of a is... ruckus is this? Oh, this is what? Attention are we getting right now? You chase after random people. <laughs> and she's got a broken arm. You need to rest. She's not a random person, though. Look, maybe she's... Maybe she's some kind of thief that you've dealt with before or something. It's today's a today's a free day. You get to relax. We promised your mom that we'd take care of you. If you're gonna follow her, let's just like walk calmly, right? Fine. Okay. I'm coming okay, with you. Okay, I am. I made something real sure quick, in trouble. and th th that wasn't it. I don't know what the fuck is that. <laughs> I don't know what. <laughs> don't this. <be> <laughs> so, question. 
Should I buy the five gold syrup or the five silver syrup? Five silver. Can we talk gold. about that later? Okay. No. This is do, you a, guys, a, do you guys? Do you guys want to? Do you guys want to shop, shop, and do festival things, or babysit with me? Babysit. You got it, mother. I'm Adios. sorry. That was rude of me. I. I meant it jokingly. Just... I mean, to be fair, what we are doing baby? that. A small human. What? <laughs> Wait, what? you don't know what a baby? Anyways. Shoo boy, what? Story, yes. Everything happening right now is very concerning. Come on, should just You're shoo concerned. Boy, let's go find your <laughs> yes. I'm gonna leave let's and I'm go. going to go buy five, okay. five bottles and this of is, paper syrup. This is gonna be a one thing that is all that is in this um festival. I'm gonna roll a D6. Ooh. Six! Ooh. Okay, so while wandering around the festival, you meet people, oh. and a oh, six lovely. is a person that you know, and a person that most of you don't know. Mm -hmm. And that I oh, have really? to find. <laughs> oh my gosh! Where did I put it? Should be around here. I have too many folders. Okay, here it is. And I, I need the other one that is in here. So, <clears throat> the person that you see that you all know, in a way or another, is uh, Barrett from the sensor of 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 uh, Eastfall. And uh, what the fuck is the token? So you see Barrett and he's accompanying another person and he seems to be talking with it we talking with him in a fashion oddly in, in a in a similar way you're talking with Noroy so going like it's a day it's your day off treat not to think too much about it you know relax a little bit come on <laughs> and he's talking with this guy Whoa. Ooh. Ooh. That app Ooh. appears to be a, a grayish skin, grayish pinkish skin tiefling with blue horns. Ooh. <laughs> and uh, and Barrett oh, notices you and go like, oh, look at what we have here. Working or actually just here to enjoy your time. Something in between. Huh. I'm enjoying it. Kind of. I do too. You are buying syrup. Oh, Sopon was you? Uh, was the name right? Yep. Got it ah. It's been a while, yeah. <sighs> what are you doing? Oh, by the way, my. I got a party. Uh, I am uh, a Conrad, Conrad Brightson, and uh, yeah. Nice to meet Just... you, sir. Nice to meet you too. Uh, he looks tired. You both tired. wouldn't have happened to see a small, uh, blonde, elvish girl pass by. I Where's actually think playing... frantically. I think I saw her going in one direction. I don't. I, I it w it went that way, it, it hints at the, uh, away, but it's full of people. <laughs> yeah, my friend here is a bit suspicious of her. Uh... Oh, could she be any, an evil doer or something? She he, he gets on in a in a in a fighting stand. <laughs> uh, possibly. <laughs> I this is how I'm I die. sir. I'd say I'd say maybe not. Uh, we don't know much about her. What she she ran about away about? when I questioned her. She wrote That's it, okay. very she wrote... suspicious. She he looks wrote... at you as very suspicious. I agree. She Conrad, wrote... for the love of she God, wrote... this is your day off. Okay? 
just just don't think about this stuff people here oh, always always here. busy always trying their best and 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 then you know you have people yeah. that come here and they get panicked because maybe they don't they don't see the person they were supposed to have a date with or something and so they just become a little bit sad and don't talk with stranger it's normal oh, you don't gosh. you don't have what? to worry that about that was incredibly that was a lot specific of words. That's... that was incredibly uh... specific well, you can I mean, it's something that like can that. happen. Well, you can either say it um, like that, or you could say being suddenly interrogated by someone you completely don't know is kind of scary. Well, she maybe, is, is, maybe she is an evildoer. Yeah, you guys should go look for her so my disabled friend can get rest. <laughs> no one... Buy maple syrup, then I'll figure this out myself. All right, if, uh, all right. Look for her, I will come with them. Uh, we are not looking for her, Barrett says, Hello. scolding Corrid. <laughs> you have to rest. You've been fighting undeads for the past month or something. So just, just stop, get some rest, and you'll see you'll get people for that quest sooner or later. Speaking and of Conrad, Conrad looks at you, uh, Silpa. Oh, uh, speaking of which, have you, have you noticed the... Quest that he put on? We saw, yes. Uh, we put it to a vote, but we couldn't choose it. You know, too many quests. Well, we might whenever you it. have uh, some time to help, it would be would be very much appreciated. Well, gladly. If uh, if nothing else, I might just come on on my own at some point. Bar and Baris goes like, <clears throat> you cannot. Back me up on this for a second. No, I cannot. It's against the law. <laughs> Just back me up on this for a second so he can wait for someone to help him. <clears throat> anyway, uh, about the undead thing, did you find out anything? You. Ah, it seems that there's still this increase of activities. It's strange. Uh, and it. And I have been investigating a little bit more about the nature of this magic. And I don't know, it's it's not completely necromantic. It's something different. It seems like the opposite. To be honest, I I have a very limited understanding of magic not truly being a spellcaster myself. Well, kinda. But yeah. Well, you see... And Barak the... like, oh, talking work again. It's fine, we're just chit-chatting at this point. Yeah, and, you um, are adventurous. That's, the, that's, that's our daily life, we talk about it, you know? Yeah, yeah, he, he said it in an affectionate way, he didn't say <laughs> to actually insult you. Um, the thing is, the last time we went on a mission, we kind of encountered something like undead, in a sense. Huh? What do you mean? It wasn't. It wasn't oh. undead. It was something worse. Worse? What do you mean it's... worse? It broke my arm. It oh, my arm. I'm sorry for that. I am... Can't tell if it was unnatural or if it was pure nature in and in of itself. That's very odd. Ah, I wish I could do more about it. I want to understand what's going on with this whole necromancy thing and and, and dead coming back to life. I'm, and now and now you say tell me this was this like you said natural or, or unnatural? Was it like did it look like like something dead that came back or nothing like it? It looked like some sort of, I don't know, phantasmal being sucked the life out of a bunch of dead creatures. Or like sucked their souls to come back to life. That's odd. Still nothing like, not like, nothing like the things that I've been seeing, so I'm afraid I cannot be of much help. Well, if you do encounter anything... Well, oh, for sure. I will. I will make sure to send you any any letter, any any information. I guess you're staying at the capital, right? 
Yeah, stout oak. Yeah, I guess so. I mean, I'm mostly never stopping by, but I guess I've recently visited a lot of Isfall and got friends with this guy, and and now he forced me to have a day off, I guess. Yes, you, you deserve it. You need some rest. I feel like I'm hearing oh. echoes. I kind of just, like, I just, like, kind of look at Naroy. <laughs> what? Well, so, now I don't with say work anything, talk but... Done, you know. Now with work talk done, you He's both got a good are going point. to relax. Oh, yeah, yeah. At this point, I think it's the best. Just taking some time off. Anyway, uh... Good. Have a have a nice festival, I guess. You too. Yeah. See, you, look. See you around. Bye bye. And they go. Which way did he point again? Syrup. Let's see that we're not buying you five gold. Shupo, are you very? Uh, would you say like? Easy, do you think you could spot her in a crowd? I believe I can. Okay, I pick him up. <laughs> on my hey. shoulders. Come on. Watch out the arm. <laughs> yeah. Be careful with I'll be careful with the arm, but I just gotta pick him up. This is insulting. I mean you see you a lot of most... you see a lot of dads with their kids on their back or like like so it kind of feels <laughs> similar. No father. You look young enough to be a kid. And, um, it's fine. And not too far from there. Actually, roll me a perception check. Okay. <laughs> yeah, not too far from there. You can see that uh, the girl has, I'd say now, calmed down. And tell me if I'm wrong, but you're probably just checking around for books. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. I'm you see her? I do. She's over there. I walk in the direction he pointed. Please keep him on your shoulder. Can you while, while holding it? While holding yes. It? Yeah. Please use it as can a weapon. You please let me down. <laughs> okay, I just to, like squat down and like put it on, put him on the ground. <laughs> okay. Okay, so you walk five. closer. I'll go buy some <laughs> bottles of syrup. Roy, just you want to buy my bull syrup? Syrup? Go, uh, a silver one. Just yeah. advice, please. The silver one. Subtle, okay. And maybe a bit less aggressive. The silver, the one silver one is for a small bottle. If you pay five silver, you get us a, a bigger bottle, much bigger. How much bigger? Uh, it's like small bottle is for like three servings, four servings. Uh, the big bottle is probably for 15 serving. This is, this is a big bottle. Buy three big ones. I'm three going to stop ones. him from buying three big ones. <laughs> no. Compromise. Old. One big and one small. Too big. One big and two small. Five and 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 the and the and the vendor and the, the vendor woman goes like, perhaps you want this one instead, and it shows you one <laughs> that is like medium size for like about ten servants, but it's the good shit. Ah, Cost five gold. Like, give him a huge <laughs> five <laughs> gold for, for it's the good shit. You can the bottle itself is really good. It's really fancy. So cool is having to stop himself from buying it. Peter is heavily breathing. They Come on, just five breathing. gold. Just you know what? what? Just because it's you, I I will make four gold and five silver. Damn. Just a ten percent discount. I like all the dynamics going on oh, today. Charisma saving <laughs> against myself. I, I, right, this right. is meant to be a little bit more uh, of a role play session, and it's gonna be chaotic, so it's gonna be <laughs> fun. I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna just whisper to Cedar. All right, listen. No, <laughs> we should not. We should, I know we both want to, but we should not. He is rolling. Oh God. Oh God, why was he rolling? <laughs> All right. 
should not. I'll, I'll refrain from buying it. I mean, no, I if it's know. all it's the money, the problem. You can always try to win something at the local game. There's local games. Games. Yes. Where? <laughs> just like. And it, and, and, and and basically uh, points at the at the opposite direction. Fuck. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna turn to Luna. Or a more syrup. I'm just gonna... uh, Five silver. I I really want to, but I kind of want to take care of uh, Shubo right now. I'm I gonna can take care of Luna. myself. Uh, um, Luna, I will listen. put an X on that. <laughs> Shubo, I'm, I'm still gonna come with you, but All right. you have to Luna, come Luna. play games with me later after this. Luna, I have an idea. For yeah. now, we're gonna go play games and you stay with him. Next, we're gonna switch. Alright? Okay, okay. Oh, no. Alright, plan. Yes. Gonna admit. <laughs> we're babysitting you tonight and you have no say in it. <laughs> So who's going <laughs> away? Sorry. I we and think Cedar so. Pa and Cedar wanted to play games. And okay. I'm sticking with Shubo. Are you doing anything with the with the girl? Uh, okay. Uh, you can roll me a perception, uh, Lisa. All okay. right. Got this. <laughs> I do have perception. Maybe it won't be I did bad. buy one bottle of the normal syrup. Good. Big one. Okay, you buy one normal syrup. Discord. Okay. Here we go. So it's finally Good. working. Ah. You don't <laughs> notice them. You are just stuck on a on peculiar, very beautiful book about the history of Saturn. Hmm. It's really cute and it has a lot of fun facts. Okay. So you don't notice them literally behind you. Shubo, I can like get on one side of her so she doesn't like run away, but you have to promise not to be too aggressive. You don't want to scare her off. I know. Come at it <laughs> diplomatically, okay? All right. These cups don't light up. And it's pissing me off. <clears throat> what you Excuse doing? Excuse me. I'm gonna. I. <laughs> no, stop. Gonna, gonna jump a little bit. I apologize if I scared you earlier. I didn't mean to do that. It's, it's fairly obvious I'm surrounded now, right? Yep. Okay. <laughs> I was about to make a very... No, oh, no. Bad joke, I'm not gonna make it. <laughs> uh... No, 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 no. It's even worse than that, Arthur. <laughs> oh, no. Kind of... Uh... Can't... I'm just gonna look um... between the two of them. I'm sorry, ma'am. Can you just, uh, humor us for one moment? What do you want? <laughs> don't watch it. No! Don't, don't, don't. No! Don't. Don't. <laughs> don't. <laughs> just don't. Don't. I, I, had, don't to, I had to let it out. <laughs> I'm not sure if I want to understand. I hate sorry. this. <laughs> you can thank me later. Anyway, uh, continue. She just kind of looks between the two of them. Is what do you what do you want? Please, just a moment of your time, please. Tell me oh, totally why Lisa. I know Lisa you. Is five five, pretty much the max I can go. <laughs> How tall is Karoy? We're the but, same height. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just taking care of my two little kids. <laughs> You're obviously hiding something. Please just tell us. <laughs> OK. 
Okay, let me let me think of something. Ah, okay, that's good. <laughs> okay, they they stole a flower earlier. Um, you. It it fell on the ground and nobody was nobody was looking at it, so I, I picked it up. I didn't want it to be stepped on. And I know you because you. Did that before? I don't know, maybe. Maybe you saw me pick it up, maybe. I don't know where you know me from. Look, ma'am, something is clearly not adding up. <laughs> where are you? I know you because when you fell from heaven, I was there. <laughs> something like that. <laughs> No, <laughs> I'm sorry. You both found his soulmate. The Roy, oh man God. of many lives. How did the sable Avery? <laughs> well, it's Lisa now. Okay, let's do something else instead. Why are you not telling me anything? She just told you something, bro. <laughs> That's <sighs> because I was told not to talk to strangers. That's fair. I am... God. You <sighs> see how bad we look right now. Check, checkmate. I am clearly not a stranger. What? Oh, come on. Miss Leona, just trust me on this. Yeah, yeah. I... You're confident so it must be something i just <laughs> the entire situation is just a lot <laughs> yes it would certainly be easier if a if this person here would tell us but <clears throat> i kind of clear my throat and lightly put my hand on her, on her shoulder oh. ma'am my friend just wants answers, so if you would just tell him whatever is the issue, that would make it easier for all of us. And I just lightly tighten my grip just a bit. <laughs> you roll, in, roll intimidation, <laughs> just why not? Yeah. <laughs> Look, I have intimidation proficiency. I want to use it. <laughs> Depending on the thing, I'm gonna have fun. <laughs> Here's the thing. Here's the thing. She is intimidating, but you know her. Yeah. She's not really intimidating you. You know that she's yeah. kind of an oddball, so it doesn't have that much an effect on you. And that's fun. Because, Noro, you see this. You know, you you notice how she's she means to be threatening in in a in a subtle way, but but this person in front of you is unbothered. It's it's strange, don't you think? You are making it clearer by the second. It's like your dad scolding you. It's <laughs> like, but you know that he's like, <laughs> you know him, so you're just like, oh yeah, he's a dumbass. <laughs> yeah, basically. <laughs> Okay. <coughs> Look, ma'am, this was... You clearly do. This was supposed to be... Supposed to be a relaxing day, and you're... Like an inquisitives. Can, you... Can I see, do I, like... I'm making it the opposite of that. Am I picking up on anything here? Where... You are... Your, your, your brick is slowly going back to be a brain. <laughs> and, um... You can also roll me an insight. Let's see. I've actually got pretty good insight. No one not like amazing, but you know. You're noticing something odd from the way she didn't react. It's it really she, feels odd. She seems skittish. It's kind of hmm. defrosting, exactly. <laughs> you gotta get that ice off the brain. Uh, Okay, um... 
you're the one making it stressful for yourself. I kind of look at Shufo. <laughs> Does have a point. If you would just tell me, then this, this will all be over and we can all go back to our lives. I let go of her shoulder. Kind of just brush it off that shoulder. Fine. Thank you. Please stay here. She looks at Luna. Hmm? Uh, why? I'm gonna grab Naroy by his good arm and I'm just gonna oh. walk off in a direction. What? Oh god. <laughs> He's gonna kill him! <laughs> I follow. I kind of. I, I gotta. I have to. I have to follow. <laughs> do I notice ma uh, you're following? Ma'am, I can't let you do that. <laughs> <laughs> just kidnap Noroi. I'm just gonna follow. You probably notice I'm not making myself super quiet. Stay there, please. I. Oh my god, Kijo's gonna kill me! <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, I didn't know about the thing with Kijo, so. Um. Miss Leona, I am old enough to take yes, care of myself. Sir. Wish I was. If she either. pulls out a knife, please run. <laughs> or, like, yell. I'm I good. know how to deal with people that have a knife. I'm just gonna I'm one just handed gonna, like stay there, I guess. <laughs> right. I'm just looking for a place that's secluded. It's sa it's secluded, safe enough. People are mostly in the heart of the village, but and and uh, in the in the other parts, in that more outside part, it's no one. It just really kind of. Out. I just kind of lead on a sh lead on a stand awkwardly. <laughs> besides a couple of guards patrolling, but besides that, nothing. Uh, Lisa is gonna take an anxiety-filled breath. Of all of that, that took a took a lot out of her. She's gonna let go of you. Okay. This is Avery's voice now. <laughs> you, you caught me. Oh. So sorry, I, I didn't mean to cause trouble. I just. It's all right. It's all right, Miss Desmond. Calm down. I, I was just curious, but I didn't want to get in the way of your fun. You. You would never do that. We like having you with us. You don't have to be alone. Besides my family. Hmm. Well, you can can get used to having people with you now, mm. because I don't think we're going any anywhere. Did the bot die? The bot died. SMH bot. Fucking piece of shit. Put on a mic. No. 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 I ship no. it. I don't. The Roy, man of many wives. I feel like that's like that's that's like a he's crime. like his child now. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I think, yeah, there we go. It's back. Put oh, on Sweet Home Alabama. <laughs> no! no! <laughs> and then. Um... Oh, um... be... um... She points at your arm. <laughs> Should be relaxing. I'm just causing you trouble. 
Well, I admit this was more stressful than it had to be. But I know that you're anxious. So please don't don't worry. She nods. You can you can come with us now. You can relax together. Ah, well, that's fine. At least now I know that you're, well, you. She nods. Are you reaching back for Luna? I'll just tell them to not make a big deal of, out of it. She nods. <laughs> like you did. I was doing this for you, fuckers. <laughs> <laughs> so, you join him back? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, Luna, you see them coming back seemingly in um in in, in a peaceful demeanor, in a peaceful not way. Stabbed. Oh. My God! I told you. Look, look! I could, I could imagine the murder in your mother's eyes. <laughs> uh, right now, you have the image of Kijo looking at you while, uh, like, stabbing you at least like twenty-seven times. Twenty-eight. Twenty-eight stab wounds. I, I, I sincerely <laughs> thought there was 77, not 28. I wanted it to be a reference, but I, <laughs> I, I messed up. Oh, oh we, we fixed it. We got it. Stress level 99. Um, yeah. Beautiful. Now we know. <clears throat> what is happening? Yeah, it said 27. I, 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 I made a mistake. Uh, well, uh, did you get everything... Cleared up? Uh... Yes. Do you want to tell her, or should I? Alright. Well, it seems that this... That this lady here is... None other than Miss Desmond's. What? <laughs> oh. Kind of squid. You got, you got stilts on or something? Oh, magic is crazy. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Saying that, you you have a... You know what changelings are, so... Okay. You can make okay. one plus one. For Luna, yeah. that one plus one will equal five. <laughs> Shut yes. up. <laughs> like, uh... she's a doppelganger! <laughs> Are you going to go uh, oh back to meet the others? Yeah. Um, okay. Kind of just rub my head. Um, so, Avery, Lisa, for right now, please. Lisa, Lisa. Um, I kind of look a bit. <laughs> I kind of look a bit shyly. Am I? Am I bad at being intimidating? <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't even scare Avery. <laughs> <laughs> Avery is scared all the time. Therefore, she's never scared. <laughs> I'm not really not bad at it. What? I 
guess you're just a lot braver than I thought. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> While this is happening... Guys! You reach to a place where there seems to be a lot of people chit-chatting and, and, and cheering, and you see mainly two figures that seems to be um, working or, or, or have organized two different games. Uh, you see, so you see um, uh, one, basically one, one sort of stand that uh, has uh, um, uh, has this 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 name that is the Maple King, and in there you only see buff dudes and buff people essentially. <laughs> there, there is, everyone is buffing there. And then there is also another uh, supposed to be game that is called uh, essentially uh, Hunt the Prowler. Hunt the Prowler, and essentially you see that the or where where I put them? Here they are. He is basically the guy at the, the Maple King, and he is this little little bitch. <laughs> and uh, and hit the prowler. Uh, one is this orc buff, and the other one is this uh, a fancy look. Can uh, Alfling? Uh, if you would like to see a little bit more about what's going on at these games, you can you can tell me and you can tell me which one. I want to see what's going on with the buff dudes. Kind of gay, bro. I'll check oh, yeah. the prowler. Of course. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, as you go there to try and understand a little bit of what's going on, uh, the orc looks at you, and uh, well, before looking at you, you can see that essentially there is some kind of of big piece of wood on on some kind of uh, like platform okay and on uh, and and then there is next to it another platform with another big piece of wood and both uh, and, and this orc guy wields an axe and then there is another buff human that wields an axe and they both strike at the wood with all their might and you can see that uh, the orc guy makes a much stronger cut okay and go uh, and and the people start cheering Gola, yeah, Torcus cannot be beaten. Cannot be beaten. I told you. And um, and you can see that the uh, the buff human goes to Torcus, this uh, supposed to be uh, uh, orc, and gives him a, 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 a small pouch of money. And and Torcus goes like, <laughs> "Soldier, I am the Maple King," and he goes away. And then you're basically standing there like a fish, like a llama, and um, you're... Um, llama. Yeah, llama is a fish. Uh, and... Um, and and Torcus looks at you and goes like, oh, Next participant, you? You like to test your strength? Yes! Yes! <laughs> You, you go He's closer, bouncing. and uh, mm -hmm. and he looks at you and goes like, "Okay, so, what do you know about the game? Have you ever tried?" Nothing. Explain it okay. to me. Okay. Yeah, sure. Okay. Since you're new, I'm gonna give you two chances. If perhaps you, <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's not gonna be enough. But let me tell you, the game is simple. Take the axe. We chop at the wood, and the one that deals the most damage and, and proves him to others to be the strongest, wins. You bet the money you prefer. I usually go with three, three quarters. And if you lose, you lose all of the bet. If I win, I give you 50% on top of the bet. Essentially... Uh, this is gonna this is gonna be explained a little bit more uh, mechanically. You can bet one silver or one gold or ten golds. If you lose, you lose all of it. If you win, 
you win you win it uh, you 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 don't lose it and you get a 50% more so if you win with one gold you would get one gold and five silver so essentially you don't lose anything but you win five silver your the prize is 50% the loss is 100% so losing is much worse winning is much, is uh, losing it's uh it's bad bad winning it's good but not too good it's kind of a of a sneaky a, a, a sneaky math going on. Welcome to carnivals. Yeah. It, it, it's festival. Everyone is trying to like trick you. So, I mean, to be fair, at this point, so I saw a buff dude breaking something. He is excited. He is. A Mechanically excited. speaking, I will tell you also that essentially you have to make an attack crawl. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then, if your attack roll is good enough, you have to make a damage roll mm -hmm. with the axe. The axe is going to be a d10 plus your strength. All right. You sum your attack roll and your damage roll, mm -hmm. and who has the highest sum wins. All right. Okay. Here is a uh, question. This is mechanical. Um, yes. Two things. Can I rage and can I reckless? Sure. No one is telling you can you cannot. <laughs> Keep in mind that raging also uh, triggers wild magic. Yes, that's the the thing is. I really want to see what wild magic triggers because if it's the one I really want, it might be useful. Okay. I think there's also, one that you could also blow up the stand with a flump. Exactly. If I get a flump, I'm gonna blow up the fucking thing. I mean, the That's stand is good. mostly like uh, an empty arena, so you don't. There's not really much to blow up besides wood. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna act like so, I'm not good, man. His, uh, his, it goes like, okay. Keep grab this, and he uh, yeets you an, a, a, an axe, and go like, good luck, and may the strongest be the maple king. But I have a feeling that I'm sorry, you're gonna lose. So, by the way, what's your bet? One goal. One gold. Okay. Middle is best. So, uh, roll an attack roll. Um, if you want to, uh, the reckless, etc., etc., you can do it. All right. Um, so, Slipa is excited, right? Mm -hmm. This is a challenge. This is a test for his strength, and he's he's had it rough since last time, and he is filled with determination and a lot of emotion. He is going to rage. He is going to rage. And reckless. Okay, you can roll me a d8 first to see the magic effect. Six. Let me check what was the sixth one. Good god, I forgot about it. Um. What is it? Again, um... You're surrounded by multicolor protective lights. You gain a plus one bonus to AC. Okay. And while ten feet of your allies gain the same bonus, it's just AC. You so. go super okay. sane. You He's you glowing. you grab the axe, and you see basically pumping strength all over your body to the point that you start shimmering with light, and people goes like, "Whoa, what the fuck is that?" And uh, <laughs> go and try. All right. Uh, here is the attack roll, which is going to be reckless. It is plus my strength. Here you go. Okay. That's why I have a. This is not reckless. I have a advantage on it, right? Yes. So, we got to do the thing. Here. Okay. So it's a fifteen total. Okay. Mm -hmm. You now have to roll a d10 plus your damage, so you can also add your rage bonus. 1d10 plus 5 plus 2. That's 11. So your total is 26, right? Mm hmm. Okay. Let me roll for him. If I find my dice. Fuck me. <laughs> Where, what I have my. Oh, me. here it is. Here it is. Okay. It's gonna roll. Uh... So. You bring your axe and you slam it down as he does the same. Okay? And the cheer 
the, the crowd cheers as you see that both the wooden pieces getting deeply just deeply cut but it's clear that one of you made a, a better cut and that one it orcus Strong, strong. Strong, strong. His total was a 28. Damn it! Goodness. He yeah. looks at you and goes like, huh, you're good. But I told you. This is fun. I am stronger. Pay up. He's going to reach out and just toss him a gold coin. And as I told you, I usually grant just one chance to people. But if you want to try again... I have to pay up agree. again. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you have to bet again. That's for sure. Swindled. Mm -hmm. Sure, why not? Here's another gold. Gold? Yes. Okay. Go again. Roll again. It's gonna roll as All well. Right. Same thing. Uh... Ooh, this is gonna be hard to beat. Oh, he... He rolled the fucking... That 20, didn't he? I'm 15. That's my eyes. Okay. <laughs> Another reckless. Uh, and you can roll uh, a damage. Plus 5 plus 2. That's not... That's not how you do it. 10 plus 5 plus 2. Come on! That's... Better. Okay. You both That's take deep axe deep. Mm -hmm. and you swing down. Two cuts deep within the wood. The the, the cheer the, the cheer the, 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 the crowd is cheering and looks at the at the at, 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 at the at the situation and, and and they start talking with each other like what 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 what, what? oh my god I didn't thought it was possible. And it goes like, huh. Well, apparently we have a tie. What? Y you both had a total of 28. <laughs> it goes like, well. It's your choice. You either keep the money or we go for the third round. Hmm. One second. And if you look at the wood, it's actually cut basically in the, in the, in the same way. I'm going to go for a, th for a second round. Two. Why am I so surprised? Uh, okay. Roll again. And it's rolling right. again as well. Okay. Come on! 17! Okay, roll for damage. Here's for damage. Oh, that's fine. Come on! Ooh! Come on! Okay. You, go, you prepare yourself once again, and you both, uh, after taking a, a, a different piece of wood, and you both swing the axe down with strength. His cut goes deep. Deeper than, than before, rolling a really good uh, strength in, 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 the, in the wood. And you take your axe, and you push, you pull all the strength into it, and your cut is different. You fucking cleave the thing in off. Releasing, uh, unleashing all your strength and, and might. There's no doubt you are the winner. Ah! Who's the best king now? Ah! Well, <laughs> gotta, gotta say that I am indeed impressed. <laughs> Takes uh, five silver and gives it to uh, gives it to you. You're done good. Thank you. And you people just chit chatting and cheering and stuff like that. <laughs> on the opposite side, and you see this elfling on top of a barrel going like, "Hey, the, uh, 
Anyone wants to play Hunt the, the Prowler? Anyone? And you see people that are just chit chatting, going, ah, It's too hard, it's too hard, I cannot do it. What is this Hunt the Prowler? Oh, yes. It's, um, it's a small game that I made, you know. Uh, you may be interested in trying it. I it's, believe uh, so. It's a game that requires a certain amount of skills, precision, and ability. You see? And it shows you basically this this um, arena that has been... Not, not arena, like, it's something like uh, after a wooden counter, you can see this um, uh, wooden figures with, uh, with a target that seems to move... Uh, uh, and, and they are shaped like a prowler. And it seems to move trying to dodge possible quote-unquote bullets. And the bullets in this case are shot by an, uh, a bow. Simple enough. You take the bow and you shoot until you miss. Hmm. Depending on how many uh, how many you get to bring down, you win your prize. Why prowlers? Prowlers are fast. And to be fair, it's not un it's not too uncommon to see them coming from uh, from the west from uh, of here. Oh, and personally speaking, I come from from a little bit uh, from from east of here. Uh, com I come from the southern of Eastfall, so I'm kind of used to prowlers. No, I'm not really from this place. I just come here to make my game. I see. So, what do you think? Want to play? Uh, sure. Well, you can uh, can play five five copper, two silver, or one gold. If you pay one cop five copper, you can only f you, you the the moment you fail even once, you're done. If you pay two silver, you can fail once, and uh, you you can uh, uh, and if you play uh, one gold, you can fail twice, and the third fail you're out. Are there any prizes? Oh yeah, depending on how many you go, you you bring down, you win. Uh, you win much more, but you gotta have to win. There is prizes. I'm not gonna list them because there is a little bit of a calculation, but yes, there are prizes. All right, I'm up for the challenge. So, how many? One gold. One gold. Okay. It gives you the, the this 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 bow and arrows that are m meant to be a little bit blunter, so that you can push push down the uh, the targets. And the game is simple. Uh, you roll an attack roll it, as you are using a bow. Okay. So if you have proficiency with bows, you can use the proficiency with bows. And the DC increases. Every time, um, uh, depending on how many you you, bro uh, you brought down, so the game is going to be increasingly harder. Okay. Mm -hmm. So whenever you're ready, start with the first attack roll. Uh, no, 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 no. Alrighty. Uh, Cedar, tell me, do you feel lucky? Uh, <laughs> after that, not really. I'm asking, I'm asking Cedar. I'm not asking Train, by the way. <laughs> Cedar, do you feel lucky? Cedar has never had luck in his life. Well, you bought a lucky leave. Oh. Do you not feel lucky? Sure. On this day, on this sunny day, I'll we'll say it's lucky. Yes. Uh, you can hear a faint crack as the leaf kind of breaks in your pocket. And you can reroll. Yeah, the leaf is meant to uh, grant a, uh, a nat one reroll. 
it's so it's literally the lucky feet yes but in an item yeah it's a it's a pocket lucky okay that's a success i use it on a carnival game i mean it's not completely broken it's just a dent it's gonna it's gonna look still cool as a souvenir but it's, it, it lost its effect essentially uh you can roll for the second one Okay, that, that's an, an, another one that hits. Ah. And that's a fail, so you get one fail. Yeah, he just kind of scoffs a little. That's a hit. You see, increases. Easy game. That's a hit. That's also easy a game. Okay. That's a hit. That's also a hit. You're doing great. Fifteen is is barely enough. Yes, you're doing you 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 you're doing okay. Continue. And that's Shit, okay. dude. You're doing great. Uh And that's not enough, so you get that's your second fail, so you can roll again. And that's gonna be your last one, okay? Your your yeah, your last one fail, so okay, that's good, okay. Oof. And that's it. So you brought down one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You brought down ten, and the, and the guy goes like, ah, "You did quite well. I am surprised. Well done." This is this is my element. I'll tell you, many people have trouble even reaching to bring three down, even with all the with all the additional tries. Uh, still far away from the from the record. Uh, the record is nineteen for now. It's quite it's quite a, it's quite achievement. Uh, but here with ten down, here's your prize, and it gives you four gold points. Hmm. Four gold coin. Yes. I hope you enjoyed it. I did. Hold on. You said there was a record. Yes, there is a record. Best score. Can I play again? I want to beat the record. <laughs> you sure? Hmm, yes. Uh, I'm not gonna stop you if you want to play again. Uh, but as you says that I say that uh, the group uh, reunites. So, in case. Hello there. And towards them, I go. What's this? Names. What <laughs> was there too? There it is. Alright. I'm gonna spend one more gold piece, so I'm gonna go again. Okay. I'm just gonna you wanna stand go? there. Okay. <laughs> oh. That's a good one. Ooh. Bullseye. That's a good one. Bullseye! Oh my god! What the fuck? <laughs> Lisa and Cena's fucking golden uh, token. That's the miss. <laughs> that's also a miss. My luck Ooh. got depleted. Yep, it did. <laughs> yeah, that's all. 
Well, so miss. Look, he got you two done... nat 20s. You gotta give him some credit. He's, he's... I'm sorry. You have done really well with those, but otherwise the, the guy oh. would just go lose all this money. Oh. <laughs> Poor C. Oh, wow. Well. You, you so win. Uh, I mean, you went good, really, really well with a couple of those, so that's impressive, but. With three down, you win this, and it gives you one silver piece. Oh. Eh, better than nothing. And honestly, I'm just more upset that I uh, choked in front of my friends. <laughs> it's okay. It always like that when when you have more pressure on Ooh. behind you, eh, you kind of get a little bit, you know, rusty. See Whoa. I don't and... know how this game works, but I'm. You did good, maybe. And I rolled something, and that something is someone that comes be from behind you and goes like, "Oh, look at all of these people!" Ah, <laughs> oh. oh. Cedar, oh. don't choke him. Cedar, don't choke. <laughs> is is so far there, Ken? Yes, you're all oh. you're all reunited now. Okay. Next to the to the counter prologue. And oh wait, she's not alone. Wait a second. Oh. Oh. Uh, I have oh. to get. Oh. I have to. I have to get the right folder. Uh oh. No. Get the right folder. Please don't be. No, this is not the right folder. What is this? In cast NPCs. Plot twist. Avery's with her. Oh we my god. god. Her among us. Oh, it's the <laughs> one. Oh, it's oh, it's the other one. Same oh, that girl. Sensors. Yeah, I know that person. <laughs> oh, it's another person. Oh. Oh, oh, the fudge. No. We don't know that person. Hi, guys! Uh, Cordelia goes like, Oh, you're yeah, enjoying the festival as well. That's sweet. Taking a day off. Uh, oh, yeah. We're doing that. And what's this blonde girl? I think I met her before. Why do you just notice that instantly? <laughs> uh, She's getting very because... noticeable. I mean, yeah, you you all where is Avery? I feel like oh what she's, perception does she have? She's uh back she stayed behind. Yes, she she thought that this was too much for her. I mean, yeah. considering that how she looks always a little bit worried with people, you know. And Lori Lori goes like, Hi guys! Nice to see you here. Oh, I don't think you have ever met her. Um, uh, she's Modesty, and Modesty goes like, "Hi, Modesty Quarry from uh, the Sensor Office of Porch Albius." Uh, nice, nice to meet you. you. Nice to meet you too. I hope you we, we can get to work as well together. Cordelia, are you just like? Do you are you like good friends with all the sensor people? Like the, oh, yes. your fellow, your fellow desk, uh, sec, hand, hand yes. Yeah, the hand. Yes, That's I cute. made friend with everyone. Yes, that makes sense. I mean, to be honest, I'm kind of among the renowned uh, handlers of of the sensor. I am one of the newest one, so I I learned a lot from my from my seniors. Don't what call makes... me a senior, Laurie says. I am. I, that, that makes me feel old. You're not. Old. Oh. I'm not old. You always did kind of give me a bit. Grandma a bit vibes. Old vibes. That's rude. Just a bit. I'm not in a rude. In like a. You in seem a mature wise. Way. You seem. Exactly. Tell me you're 48. You seem experienced. Here. I'm 48. What? What? Huh? We're used to people looking very young. 
Oh yeah, I mean, if you no. if you see elves like like, I mean oh, right, people that, people that have strange sense. way of uh, of having their own uh, age, I guess. Uh, I'm, to be honest, you know, considering that she's an elfling, by the way, she's smaller, mm. she's more than than others. So I'm gonna, but she's still quite young. Uh, modesty like... is quite clearly a neurogenus. Hmm. Cordelia, how long have you uh, have worked as a sensor person? Uh, I, I think like a, around one year, a little bit more, a little bit less. Wow. You're really talented for uh, like you're good with people, so it's surprising hmm. that you're so uh, inexperienced with it. No, I don't. I, I mean, I don't perceive it as talent. I just perceive it at me learning the things by listening to those that know more than me. Okay. Modesty, for example, taught me a lot of things, especially the the whole, uh, you know, the intricacy of work of of paperwork. And uh, I mean, I have known uh, Lori for quite a lot of time. She was actually the one that convinced me to get it into this job. Well, then we owe you a thank you. <laughs> I'm sure uh, Ventrin wouldn't be quite as fun without uh, our favorite sensor. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, oh. You, you flatter me, and also I feel that that could be a little bit disrespectful for the others. But uh, thank you're you. the one we work with. Not Yori, Yori we love you too. You're great. Of course I am. Modesty. <laughs> You're probably like awesome. One. I've never met you, but... Oh, don't worry, guys. I am... Uh, I, I'm sure that we are going to have... Uh, uh, wait, uh, some some chances to play... To, uh, to, to, to work together, so... Yeah. Don't worry. You seem and like and to be nice honest, person. Cordelia is really good, so... Uh, you should... You know, consider her as such. <laughs> Anyway, uh, Cordelia and Laurie should we, you know, continue strolling around? I'm kind of getting hungry. And, and, and Laurie goes like, yep, I'm getting hungry as well. And, uh, and goes like, well, guys, I think we're going, we're heading off. And, um, and Cordelia nice goes, little... Cordelia goes like, oh, yeah, yeah I'll, 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 I'll go with you in a moment. Uh, and, uh, um, as they take a step, it, uh, Cordelia goes like, so, you're liking the city? You're liking the, well, town? Well, not really city. Very uh, much so. Yeah, it's nice. Mm -hmm. yeah, having yeah. a chaotic time. Yeah, I mean... Yeah, it's it's been buying a bit. Just... Syrup, right? Did you buy it or not? Yes. Well, well, one, yes. Yeah. Yeah, well, I mean, the maple syrup that they have here is really good, especially if you take like the max the top quality one. You're not gonna go, you're not gonna go away from it. It's it's so good. I have tried it once and I, now it's ruined for me. Like I only get to use that one because it's so good, you know. So, well, just you know, have fun, enjoy this, the, the 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 festival, and I don't know if you know it, but. Try not to go too north, you know. It's uh, there are a couple of rumors. I, I I don't know about it, but just just stay away from the northern side, you know. When if you see the the lonely house on on the north, don't don't just just be be wary. Let's say what kind anyway, of rumors? You know you don't know about the crazy hag. I, no, tell would us. This, would this be common? Don't believe I do. Ah, well, the story of the crazy was... hag. Oh god, she telling us about a. Okay, so uh, and, and Lori steps back in. Okay, so here's the story. Apparently, this crazy hag, and she lowers her voice. This crazy hag is this old woman that. Is has been here and have been acting strange and crazy for a lot of time. But here's the strange thing. Despite her being so strange and crazy and unwelcoming of people, apparently the people that remember her from before 
they remember her from the very past. They remember her as not only someone that is not crazy, but someone that is very intelligent. Mm. Intelligence in be- meaning that it was one of the most brilliant mages of all. We're talking about oh. 50 years ago. Mm. Oh. To the point that, and she leans closer. There are rumors that she has been a certain one teacher in the oh. past. Oh. You know? That's... But those are rumors. Those are rumors. I... Yeah. Yeah, that's interesting. Anyway, let's go, girls. And they go away. A teacher? Look. I look to all of you. A certain one I... is underlined. It's just because yeah. they don't yeah. want to name the name. They I don't look... want to name him. It's obvious. I it's look obvious. To all of you. <laughs> We're Little on Galloway. a break. Little Galloway. Day. We're on a break day. We're going. We need re- relaxation. I want to be there. <laughs> Wait, what? Very strong. I want to arm wrestle her. She, I don't say... think she's strong. She's an old woman, probably. She's yes. an old woman, but she can cast spells. What if she's like Avery? The the, the hag is like they don't meant what it as someone that is dangerous. It just meant someone as that is strange. I think it's just crazy. like. I feel like this. I, I don't know. It just it feels like we're like doing work because she's we're related not. to like. Rrr, rrr, rrr. We're no, no, no. We're just exploring, right? Let us relax first. And Dieter is gone. <laughs> oh, Where did he go? Where did he go? <laughs> I have bought. Ah, the maple syrup, because I rolled a one on charisma. <laughs> okay, you come back Dieter. with the, with this beautiful oh, maple God. syrup. Cedar! Cedar, no! Oh, what How much time? did that cost? Ten gold, was it? Oh my God. Five. What? Five, five for gold. the medium bottle. For the medium bottle, Ooh. five. Ooh. That's expensive. All right. All right. First thing first, oh why did you buy that? I told you not to do it. Now all syrup is gonna be ruined for you. Second I don't know, up, man. Cordelia just talked about it and I just she, felt the urge. She sold it for you. <laughs> it's gonna ruin all other syrup, what is what she said. You're very influenced by Yeah. No. I kind of like words. You know, I'm, just, I'm just gonna say, uh, <laughs> to be honest, Cedar, here, at this I've point, noticed, I think you like her. N- I've noticed you really like, what? uh, well, you bought this syrup, you must really like sweet things and like e- maybe even sweet people and sweet Spencer. <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. You're not very okay. good at lying. Is that a bit inappropriate? It's just mm-hmm. messing with it. Mm-hmm. Actually, speaking of you, you <coughs> saying telling us to relax is a shock on its own. Yes, like I said, let us relax first and then check you out this crazy hag. I'm later. gonna, I'm gonna I lean like... into Luna. <laughs> I'm gonna lean into Luna. Like, hey, are we sure it's that he didn't hit his? No, is he's... he okay? No, he just uh, he dealt with his issue earlier, and I looked at Lisa, who has not been oh. introduced to. Sofa. Yeah, she's just there. <laughs> right. She's standing yeah. there silently the entire yeah. time. Uh, hi, hello. Who are you? I'm used to random people appearing. Beautiful syrup has been added to my inventory. <laughs> Lisa, is this still the Avery voice? No. Okay. Well, nice to meet you! Uh, oh, yeah. I won five silver from the game, but from before. Oh. Speaking what of, game? you should try it. Okay. Uh, I got you take a... the tax. I got and you a hit net a game. Of wood. But and I got it's a, great. I got a net gain of two gold. Well, that's pretty good. Hmm. You just hit a 
Well, you, you hit. You use an axe to chop wood. Yes, like and it's, it's and you and silver. another person, and whoever hits the wood harder wins. You have to just bet your money. Hmm. Uh, I think I the shooting know. game is easier. I mean, maybe. And, um, easier, but are you I'm... are you checking around the, the stands and all like, or you're staying still? I am. We're most books. staying still, I think. That's the whole reason why I snuck out here was to look for books. <laughs> Okay. You're checking around. I... Cedar, what about you? I I <laughs> already bought a lot already, but I think I'm Like are you are me. you standing still in front of the games or are you moving a little bit around? I think I'd be moving. Well, I guess let's just all talk and walk around. And yeah, yeah you'll we'll all talk and walk around a little bit, talking about the games and stuff. At some point, I... Cedar, you in specifics, you're interrupted by a familiar voice. Eh. We gotta get to meet Cedar and uh, a voice that has been quite a, a little bit of time since you heard last time. Oh. You know? Uh, at first, you don't. I put in here. I don't know why. Going on. What? Where, where is it? To the void. Adventure into the void. Oh. At first, you didn't. Uh, you you don't realize. You don't recognize oh the situation. Oh my god. But he is Arun. Who? Arun Emwick. <laughs> <laughs> Forgot this guy existed. <laughs> yes, I, I, I have, I have used all of your backstory. <laughs> oh, look at what we have here! My favorite pl medicine, medical plant supplier. Oh, hey, Aaron. I look back to my friends, and then I do a double take, like, what, Aaron? Aaron, what? What? <laughs> what? You surprised that um, me? I'm. Um, a, um, a traveling merchant would be at a festival selling. I mean, what, what about put you? Put it that way; it's not surprising. What about you? The last time I went to the shop to get my my medical herbs, and you know, uh, you know, I am paranoid about snakes and stuff. Uh, it was poor me. It wasn't you. The shop. Oh. You've got a shop. Uh, yeah, don't worry about it. Um, <laughs> I just brush her off. He's got a... He's got a shop? He's... Well, you told me about adventuring, and I was oh, yeah. kind of interested, and I ended oh, up leaving you... the shop in the hands of poor me and became an adventurer. The hands of who? Uh, do you became an adventurer? Do you became a seeker? Wink, wink. <laughs> I wink back. Okay, okay. Yeah. Anyway, hello guys. I am. Uh, let me present myself. I am Aaron Emwick. Uh, I am just a, about a humble merchant that specialize in magical nonsense, basically. My shop mm -hmm. is in Port Obvious, but since there was this festival, I thought of bringing a little bit of merch here. So if you would like to see anything. Take a look, and if you want, I can tell you what he has. What kind of stuff does he you sell, sir? Magical nonsense. All magical mm. stuff that it's mostly for fun, I would say, but I don't I know. Was... It can be particularly... Um, I, I don't think it's mostly useful for combat, been... perhaps with enough creativity. Can... I mean... If do you have like more like minor stuff that isn't too expensive as well? Oh no 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 not too expensive of course. I was just uh, I've been He's looking cool. for a souvenir for my dad so I thought. Oh yeah, yeah I mean souvenir stuff probably not my thing. You should probably get yeah. one of the souvenirs from the Maple Festival itself. I'm not selling stuff related to Maple Festival. Yeah, I see I this more of a. Um, like... Something that can be a little bit like adv free adv advertisement, basically. Uh, this festival, I mean. 
but if you would be interested, here's the stuff that I have with me right now. But I have more in my shop. Cool. Okay. The ring of. I don't know. Oh wow, it's lots of stuff. Love potion. Ooh. Hey. Uh oh. Hey, yo. Oh. Hey, yo. You, know, you can you know. ask me about any of this. Oh gosh, I love love ask and I can so tell you more things. about it. What's the magical puzzle box actually? Magical puzzle box, you recognize it as one. Uh, <clears throat> Avery, you recognize it at one, very similar to yours. Yeah. I'm a point at it, or whatever. How much for that? Oh, this one. This one has a quite special trinket. I have found it. In, 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 like, in the... In, in, basically, in the depth. I was fishing, okay? I was fishing. And I found something shining that was basically uh, trying to be eaten by a big fish or something. So I, I managed to got it, and there was this one. It's quite ruined, but it seems to be still holding. I thought it was some kind of magical puzzle box. Uh, I still didn't crack it, so perhaps you would like to crack it yourself. Uh, this is... This would be... Uh, I would say... Let me check. It was eight, eight gold coins. <laughs> That's all my money, but it's worth it. <laughs> Wait, you, that's all it? your... I'm gonna buy it. I forgot that Avery's giving all her money to... Okay. You get the magical puzzle box. Yeah. Boop. What is... Would you be interested is... in anything else? Oh, the God. Ring of Honesty. What does it do? Ring of Honesty. Oh, this is quite the... Uh, this is quite the uh, tricky treasure. Uh, let's just say that anyone that uh, it, first thing first, this ring is you can see it, and it's basically made of silver and what it seems to be very small, very not particularly brilliant green gems. It's beautiful, and um, I don't explain. Let's just say that the person that wears it, it's kind of feeling particularly honest and upfront and 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 very uh, direct. So, if you ever feel like you cannot say the things that you want to say, just wear it. How much is it? Uh, 15, 15 gold. Ooh. Damn. Expensive. I honestly am not sure if we should give Noroi that. <laughs> He's gonna put it on us. <laughs> but then I have He's many more funny level. things. For example, I have this. And he takes the dice of masks. And you see this Basically, the size of the, the the shape of a D8, and it's completely, um, it's completely like clear, polished. It doesn't have anything on the faces. This is very fun. Let's just say that this mm. is how to say it. I think that a practical um way, a practical example is more fun. Uh, so. Any of you wants to try it? I can try. Sure. I will. Let's choose one. <laughs> Go, Luna. I'll do it. Okay. Okay, Luna. <laughs> <laughs> Roll me a D8. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I love you, beautiful. Oh, I love this. Tree. Okay. Let me check. Oh, I think that I know that. This. Okay. You roll it, and uh, basically, on oh, as it rolls and it lands on one specific face, the face brightens up, okay? Ooh. And it brightens up with yellow light, okay? And on, on the on 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 the on, on the, in the the light seems to form something that looks like a mask, okay? And this mask seems to be uh, smiling. Very smiley. For the next one hour, let me let me copy paste it. Can you read it for me aloud? For the next one hour, the face of someone who's very happy and outgoing. The person will be much more sociable and much more prone to smile and interact with others in a cheerful way. <laughs> Oh, oh wonderful. 
for one hour, you are particularly happy and outgoing. Ah, ah. this feels uh, energizing. <coughs> ah. Let's just say that it can be a, a, a funny trick to, you know, uh, spice up conversation and have fun in days when you don't really know how to feel. How much is this for? Uh, ten b gold pieces. Oh gosh, that's expensive. Um, it is magic, after all. Uh, well, uh, what just. Oh, uh, what else is there? Just like I want to. Um, what is the uh, Iron Forge loot? <laughs> Uh, okay, I will explain it very simply. This this uh, lute is literally just a lute, so like the guitar kind of thingy. Is it all but it, electric like, like, guitar? It sounds like it's a, it's it sounds like an electric guitar. Yes. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh! I um, wish I wasn't designed with like negative charisma because oh I God. would totally pick that That's up and crazy. actually form my alchemical romance. <laughs> <laughs> My um, like no romance. No. <laughs> hey, uh, what about that sword of lies. Oh, this is um, this is one that also requires a practical, uh, a practical approach. It gives it to you, and, and this is essentially a sword. You can feel it. You can you can use it, and it goes like, "Go on, strike me." Hit? Yeah, with the sword. Sure. Strike me. Oh, Alright, sure. Careful. I'm gonna go full force. Oh no. Okay, you Reckless. go full force and you and you essentially see eyes. how you, you cut off his arm. Okay? You go full force, you cut off his <laughs> arm. Oh I'm gonna no. start fucking panicking. Oh my god! And you, you, you go like oh my fucking god and he, he's he's laughing. What and uh, and and and, and and he says like, oh, and, and now it, and, and, like with arm on the ground, you can see it, it thud on the ground, mm -hmm. and he goes like, okay, now just stamp your fingers. Uh, all right, gonna. As you snap your fingers, thing. you see that every damage that the Zoid has done was an illusion. Oh. Ooh. What? What? The Zoid cannot. Something? Cannot damage. Oh, Creates the illusion of damage. That is cool. Oh. That's cool as fuck. That's so cool. He was calm because he's used to seeing these kind of antics from Aaron. Uh, Aaron uh, is a troll. How much is this for? That's really nice. It's eight gold pieces. <laughs> Alright, here is eight. Okay. <laughs> okay. That what is, is the staff uh, of Zoomanter? This is the thing. I don't know if you can read it. Mm -hmm. uh, nice. The illusion can uh, last up to one minute. Well, and in battle, you can snap your finger as a bonus action. That's, uh, that could actually be really useful. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. no. I know, like, right? We're, we, have a, we, want, we fake fighting each other. Listen, yeah. everything Aaron sells is something that can be potentially broken if you have enough creativity with it. Mm. Mm. Um, it could be good for interrogations. This could just be good for scaring the shit out of someone. Uh, even, stuff of Zoomans. Even though... Okay, let me tell you what the staff does. The staff, and you can see the staff is it's right now it's but it's kind of small okay it's a small seemingly like root uh, all all um like all around together and emitting this greenish light very dim and goes like okay for instance try to grab it Alrighty. <laughs> as you grab it you I can see oh. the root the, the the roots extend and the stuff basically regulates itself to your size okay and oh. um, it's not uh, it's not a, 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 an actual staff meant for fighting. It's a magical one. And since you have practical abilities in magic, you can understand what this kind of magic does. And he explains to you, uh, this staff can be cr to be used. Actually, let me just copy it so you can read it yourself. Uh, a 
again, this is all for funsies, but at the same time can be really useful in, in your, uh, in depending on what you're going to do. Uh, you can read it aloud, please. You can use this staff to cast a special version of Minor Illusion, specifically made to create images of animals that appear in semi-transparent glittering light. Ooh. This illusion, however, while still being one, can be talked to and can behave as a familiar while also not interacting with anything physical. Oh. The illusion itself can be any animal, but no animal bigger than large size. That's really cool. That is That's mm -hmm. If it behaves as a familiar, does that mean it can do, like, can get information for me? For example, you can make an animal and make it, uh, like, interact with someone. As long as it's not doing anything physical, or interacting with anything physical, it, it can, for example, uh, you can say, okay, I'm gonna make a monkey and I'm gonna make the monkey go to my companion so that the, the, it can make the gestures to uh, alarm him of danger, for example. You can, it's all about your creativity. It, the, the, your fantasy is, your, is the limit. Well, I mean, if I used speak with animals and then I used this, could the animal give me information like it was a spy? Technically speaking, yes. Because, of course, they have to go and then come back, etc, etc, but yes. You can. Beautiful. I'll think about it. Um... This would be 15 gold pieces. Oh, lord! Damn. I mean, it's magical what you think about yeah, it. Makes sense. By the way, uh, Avery, are you already checking the, the, the box or not? Yes. You can roll me an, uh, an Arcana check with advantage. At this point, you know how to break these things. Nice. I've broken Especially one, break them. One. I know how these bitches work. Arcana is a plus seven. You can see that he's quite, quite a, not rusty, but a little bit like in bad condition nice. to the point that the the thing, the, 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 the crest, where there should be the crest is kind of faded, but you can see traces of it. Mm. It opens. Mm. Oh, you managed to open it already. <laughs> You're much better than me at that. Mm. Well, Inside, it. there that's is... It. A piece of paper, folded. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna close it. And put it in my bag. Okay. Oh. Okay. What about the Cloak of Eternity? Oh, this is... This is very odd. This is... Probably one of the most... Strange thing I ever had. I have found it by mistake. I was once going around and humble, and I found this. I have no idea. Perhaps it's related to the, <laughs> that. Would be fun. It is related to the uh, to, to 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 the eternal chicken. Um. Anyway, oh, what? It's what? It's what? Eternal what? You, you, huh? you don't know? Oh, God. No. Come on! It's, 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 right? it's famous. Do, okay. It's do famous. Do I know? Was this something I would have read about? Oh, it's something that is very specific to this kind, to this part of the country. To the part of this part is is something that is uh, from uh, humble specifically. You can okay. roll me a history check, but it's gonna be extremely hard. Okay, I'm gonna. Hmm. <laughs> and yes, it is your yes. It, it it was that thing that you uh, that I asked. Should they put a chicken or not? <laughs> to, uh, you don't know. Holy shit! Okay. Yes, it basically, oh. apparently, uh, in, in Humble, stop somewhere, there is this chicken that is, I don't know, has been living for the past, like, 40 years or something, and mm -hmm. has, cannot be killed or something, I don't know, it's just, it's just, that's not the point, oh. so, this oh, cloak, this is the important chicken you were talking about, yes, uh, so, uh, this cloak cannot be destroyed. I have tried. It cannot. It doesn't. Cloak of it doesn't change anything. Yes. If you, if if you put it on and someone strikes you, 
Of course you're gonna be damaged. It's not it's not gonna change anything for you, but the cloak itself? No damage. Cannot. Mm. And I've tried to burn it. I have tried to freeze it and then burn it. I don't know. Huh. Perhaps it's something magical, something very strong. That... That's interesting. I just want to research that. What? Hmm. What does the cloak look like? Uh, the cloak looks quite normal and not special, not with special material and not particularly ornated. Does it look like opulent or anything? Uh, it's simple hmm. material and it's very soft to the touch. I like my cloak. It doesn't give you any combat benefit, but it's indestructible. Do Use it as you want. So wait, use it as it's freaking can, weird. And because it's indestructible, could you use it as a shield from, let's say... It's not, it's not solid. Okay, so st stuff can still go through it. Okay. Yeah. No, no, it's it's solid, but if something not, hits it, yeah, it's just gonna move shield, it and, and hit like, you. Let's say I cover myself with it, like I throw it over myself, and then a dragon breathes fire at me. Does it protect? Okay, me from here's the fire? thing. Here's the thing. You heat if it up. you have uh, a wall in front of you, mm -hmm. and someone throws uh, throws uh, uh, a cannonball at you. You're still gonna die because the cannonball, uh, even if the wall doesn't doesn't break, let's 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 imagine like this: the wall doesn't break, but the wall goes back with it, okay, yeah. and squishes you, right? So essentially, oh. the cloak doesn't stop things; it's just indestructible. If you have the cloak on top of you, and the cloak and someone stabs hits you, you, you're gonna still feel the damage from from the from the hit from the bludgeoning behind the cloak. But the cloak itself is fine. That then depends on the situation. Perhaps if uh, 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 maybe a or fire like... breathing can be resisted, maybe, or maybe acid can be resisted. Acid, surely, because acid cannot melt it. It's up to you. I have a question. Mm. Can it get wet? You don't know. It Come just on. feels like something that has some sort of secret property, because that's just a weird... It's weird indeed. Everything those, here is weird. This would be one of those items where you constantly. But this ask, is weirder because it's can mysterious. Can I use this to block this type of damage? Yeah, this is, this is the, all these items. All these items are meant to be weird enough that maybe you can use them in some absurd way. Okay. These, like the others as well, yes. I look okay. I've I've been tempted enough. Can you tell us what the potion does? Okay. The potion or the loaf potion, okay? Right? <laughs> yeah. Like, a loaf potion, you can see this, is a small vial of dusty pink liquid. It's, uh, Aaron explains, it's a particularly strong loaf filter. This is what the... Is it? it explains to you in details, and I'm gonna read uh, write it down and you can read it aloud, please. Okay. When drunk, or when someone else drinks it, it has to succeed a DC 15 charisma, or will fall in love with the person for 1d4 plus 1 days. The person will notice the difference when the time passes, but the person will remain retain. the memories potentially- will retain the memories Potentially greatly improving or ruining the relationship. You mm. will fall in love specifically with the first person that they see, but that they know. So no stranger oh. can be affected. Uh, not... I want to make the Roy drink this. <laughs> oh my god, I want to do that. I want to see <laughs> some love sick the Roy. We're all just like the Roy. This is. Particularly rare. This costs 20 gold pieces. God. I'm gonna, okay, I have an idea. I have an idea. I'm gonna just drag Luna to the side for a second. This, okay. Oh, oh uh, sorry, I didn't specify. If the person succeeds the charisma, is gonna be affected for half those days, but it's still gonna be affected. Ah, so huh. either way, it happens. Oh. Yes. 
Look it's a strong that. potion. Hear me out. What, Hear me out. what yep. is it? I'm just <laughs> saying. Already. I'm just saying. Out of the five of us, we know Roy and Avery the least. Now, Avery is a woman. I'm not going to trespass on her life. What? what? Is it? <laughs> <laughs> that's that's right. Right. Now, hold on. <laughs> My I God, mean, that's, that's so okay. sick. Okay. Wow. Still you don't even know of Avery. I mean, this is medieval times. Still yeah. Oh, yeah. No, this is no, a... Numenhurst, where racism doesn't exist. So That's not sexism either. Nice. That's a strange implication. Listen, I... she won't put up on her time, but he's Look. he's just closed off. Yeah. I, I want I want you I'm... to drink, to make him drink the potion and then make I'm... him look well... hijo. Yes. Oh, no. 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 That is so yes. no. <laughs> I have no idea what that is. Alabama is the way. I, but anyway. Look, I am reassured at... I mean, it's a... Well, that's a strange implication. I am reassured at the fact that you won't use love potions on women just for my own sake. But... Um, <laughs> I'm just saying, okay. think about love struck Neroy. We've it never seen be... that and How far never away seen are that. they? Okay, okay. Like, look. we are planning it pretty oh. openly. Just pa. I'm just. First oh, fun ball. fact. Uh, Aaron First... interrupts you. Oh, uh, uh, uh Silpa. Fun fact one of the possible results of that D8 is, um, is kind of being love struck. But yes. But we will think we about can it. either but love look, choose the D8 or ghost potion. So, Pa, mm -hmm. I agree that would be so hilarious, but that is kind of, I don't know, it's kind of weird. Like, I feel, Think about it this I way. guess it's like, don't I don't know, I feel to like, see her son love like, that would, that would kind of, I, that would probably be reassuring for Kijo to know that her son has a heart. Is, yeah. But I don't. I just don't know. It's kind of weird. I mean, I I won't. Okay, guys, 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 guys. I have a heart guys. attack. I want to. Uh, I want to underline something. This is the stuff that I brought here, and if you don't buy them now, is they're still there, and then no one else buy them. You can always find me in Port Obvious. So the stuff is not going uh, anywhere. Remember that, but okay. Anyways, what is the horn of hilarity? Oh, <laughs> right. um, this is fun, and um, so far. you can see it. It's basically essentially a big goat horn. Okay, uh, the, those uh, those one that you can uh, play essentially, like like w w war horn or something. Uh, but here's the here's the funny. Thing. I'm gonna send you the description, and you can read it. Hmm. As it can be played. Player, played. And everyone in the 30-foot radius will have to make a wisdom save, DC 10, or start laughing without really being able to control themselves until next turn. A creature laughing this way has no particular impediment in battle. However, on a nat one, the user will have disadvantage with every roll as he's laughing. Okay. This makes people laugh, like, a lot. This is great. No one has I seen just this play a meme over the horn. Oh, God. Why is Avery when and you... Roy just, like, the, the fucking targets of these items? <laughs> oh, I when you play it, the least. Use this on When you roll. play it. Surprise. Surprise, Cedar isn't a target. Yeah, Cedar's okay. a good target oh. as well. I Cedar? wanted to say one thing. Well, uh, I had a chance I'd bully Cedar to hell and back. Oh, don't worry, I'm coming. Uh, when you play the horn, everyone else is gonna, uh, everyone, including the owner, is gonna hear a different sound depending on what they may laugh. For example, if I would hear it, I would hear this. <laughs> like, the dude <laughs> always cracks me up. I don't know why. So, uh, everyone hears something different. Yes, that's so that continues on. Well, anyways, I'll buy the staff. 
you buy the staff. Okay, the staff, as I told you, is uh, 15, right? Is it 15? Yep. There goes my money okay. for a... I was going to buy armor. Staff of the Zoom Hunter. And I will take the Ring of Honesty. Okay. Oh, no. Ring of Honesty it is. Was happy to make some business with you guys. Mm -hmm. And uh, if you need anything else, you can always find me at uh, a point. Obvious, okay? And uh, yeah, I'm still gonna. I'm probably gonna go back home, like like to the to your shop and get some more medicine, medical medical herbs, just poison right. stuff, you know. And, uh, yeah, uh, so I guess I'm gonna have to expect to see poor me there, right? <laughs> Tell poor me I said hi. Yeah, sure. Poor me. Also, last time that I went here, I thought that was, uh, yeah, I think I met your sister. Mm. She was just, I think she was just checking stuff at the shop or something, I don't know. He blinks. Well, yeah. Uh, I will tell you that I will tell them that I say hi. All right. Hey. Uh, Don't get too comfortable. We're gonna buy sister. one more thing. Yes. What would you like? We're taking that love potion. Sure. It's twenty gold, right? I glare 20. at. Freaking. <laughs> so far. Uh, say... Better us than anyone else. I'm gonna say that's, <laughs> that's a good point. That's a good point. We good don't point, want somebody huh? We're else. We're just protecting it from Look, somebody. Yeah. Using it yeah for evil. That's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. Yeah. Lisa yeah, yeah, is gonna yeah. say an undercommon. Sure. Everyone. <laughs> hmm? This is an undercommon. Oh, you don't ear. understand. Get the fuck out of here. I, I didn't okay. understand either, though. Yeah, she, said, <laughs> no, yeah. just... she said, sure. Better us than anyone, but we should we really let those two have it? <laughs> I'm well, not. I'm. I'm. You I'm, are I'm, right. <laughs> is that also an undercover? Yes. <laughs> look, look, I'm. I'm not having it. I didn't. I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> it's a soap boss thing. I'm. You're all I'm insane. <laughs> Avery and Roy no, I have the most a... fucking sane ones in this group. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. I'm gonna drive him insane. I'm just trying to make some <laughs> fucking money. You guys I just, I really just, I, look, look, look. I think both me and Luda as people just want to see what this would look like. <laughs> yeah, really. Every just no, you're just gonna off. have him to uh, have him to drink it without yeah, him that's... killing you first, or having well... him kill you after he's done with it. Yes. Because he's gonna yeah. know. He's gonna yeah. notice the difference. Unless, okay, one thing that it, uh, it's not written specifically, but you can understand, is that if you make someone drink the love potion, and in between, you gave them enough memories to make them feel like they love you, they're not gonna feel the difference. Huh. Because they aren't gonna retain the memories. So that if the memories are good enough, they're gonna just retain the, 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 the emotions. So we just need to take him on a romantic picnic. With who? I have no idea. I didn't think this far. <laughs> who are you? I do who are you realize it would probably this? be someone in the party, right? <laughs> probably, and that's terrifying. I mean, you can always get <laughs> one NPC are. or something, and just just kid, you can kidnap an NPC, put them in, put them in front right. of him, Look, and, and, and make Look, him drink. There's a, Look, there's always a secret. Look, between all of us party members, there is a secret agreement that Shubo is the one that we all, like, kind of want to romance. <laughs> <laughs> Just quietly, it's no. like, out of everybody. All right, all right. I, I didn't, yeah, I didn't Cedar's, think of this. Cedar likes, Cedar likes his, Cedar, Cordelia, yeah. I think Cedar likes women exclusively so far. Cedar seems like a big gay man to me. What? Alright, so basically, 
there are three of us who could be the the second victim to this potion, right? Yeah. <laughs> it's either me, Luna, or Seer. <laughs> I thought we were going with Avery as the oh, third pick. I was about no, to say, no. I said, well, Avery isn't an option, no. okay? No, I, I think weird. Avery isn't, Wait. I think, okay, I think we're- It's all in character. I want to no, specify no, one thing. Out of character. <laughs> I want to specify yeah, okay. one thing, because this is also adds a little bit into the fun of it. Also kind of ruins it. Uh, the potion says that it falls in love, so it's not perceiving uh, a, 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 this emotion of love and the sentiment of love towards one person. Now, they're going to express it in the way they prefer and the way yeah. they would make. Mm -hmm. And also, depending on the person, perhaps it's not going to be romantic love. We just want to see what we just. If you see make, what... if you make, uh, 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 for example, let's say that you make. Uh, Noroi drink the potion in the first kid. It's not, not gonna be romantic love. It's gonna be probably love. like it's gonna be you like I want you as my son them. kind of love, you know? You just kidnap a random kid. I feel kid. like that is I feel like <laughs> so it's just... if someone drinks it and they fall in love with a kid, that's obviously a problem. Yes, because you spot yeah. the, oh, yeah. the pedo. That, yes. that yeah. means that they're. Uh, that, hmm. Well, his mom goes out the window now. God damn it! You don't know what what, what is hidden there. You don't know what is hidden there yet. <laughs> hmm? <laughs> hmm? I hate this so much. Just give it <laughs> back. We it. don't need this. It's... I think it's funny. I love this. It is. I love funny. this. We really want to do. I okay. Funny. Okay, though. How are guys, we gonna do this? Back to session, guys, back to yeah. I absolutely this love this. Situ this. This situation is so chaotic and messy. But I will also like to uh, not spend three hours on this. So yeah, uh, I was sensing a butt coming. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, your butt. Put it in. Mm. Put away. So Park can just put it away in his bag, and we'll see what happens yeah. eventually. Yeah. Listen, I I am. I'm just uh, asking one thing about this. If you ever plan something and you don't want the others to know and you plan it in DMs, make me know. Because yeah, I'm gonna I, make it more that's, fun. That's what I did with Lisa. <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh I kind of did wanna I kinda wanted to what how much was the um the what was it called? Nice. The Iron Forged Loot. <laughs> the Iron Forged Loot is <laughs> The Iron Forge loot is eight gold coins. My dad is retired. Would he like to take up guitar? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> that would be funny. He will be a rock and a, ro oh, a rock I star with that. On. And they're all broken if you're creative enough. Yeah. But what does the guitar do? Charm people. Maybe? Perhaps people that really like that kind of music would, just, would just become your groupies, I don't know. You're just really cool. Yeah. Just become Lama's, an actual rock star. Uh, not Lama. Luna's dad just becomes a famous musician. Lama's struggling with the life. Anyways. So. Pleasure doing business with you, Hemwick. Yeah. Pleasure doing pleasure okay, doing with you, pl business with you too. What happened? Yeah. No, worries, we were just saying uh, goodbye to Hamlet. Oh, okay. So, where are you going, guys? Lisa's Actually, gonna... let me roll a D. Lisa's gonna look at this Six. group. Oh. <laughs> Actually, oh, speaking of, Lisa... I think this is who I think it is. Mm hmm. Yeah, I love them. Oh. So, you go a little bit uh, away from from them as you keep talking, right? Yeah. yeah. And Luna, now you see someone that you remember, and you feel like you're seeing a double. Oh, here oh, no. they are. Oh God. Amy. <laughs> the twins. Oh, uh, guys, hey. Oh, Luna, hi. 
It's been a while. It uh, has been a while. We've been working hard. What about you? Uh, same here. Uh, I joined up with a party. Uh, these guys oh, here. Oh, you have a party already. <laughs> Hi. Nice to meet you. Uh, nice to meet. Oh, uh, I am. Uh, uh, we should have. We should have prevented ourselves. I'm sorry. Uh, my name is uh, Benfley uh, Benford, and she's uh, uh, Bethany Benford. We are Beth, Ben, and Beth. Uh, yes, we have been working a little bit in the past with Luna. Uh, she has helped us with a uh, with a task. It's nice to see you guys again. You guys getting on fine? Uh, yeah, we have been making a little bit more of this, uh, you know, rankless quests, uh, getting a little bit to get stronger, you know, train a bit more, and we're confident that we can make much more. So perhaps we're gonna participate to the um, to the tournament, you know? Tournament? Yeah. I mean, it's gonna be, I think, in um, in t about two weeks or something mm -hmm. uh, the join arms tournament it's um uh, it's in um where is it i don't remember where is it and by the way you have heard of, of it already um the, the join arms tournament is a tournament that has the uh, is made basically every kind every like you two years every year depends sometimes they skip and sometimes they don't skip essentially is a tournament that is uh financed financed by the um, by the kingdom to essentially make this big display of people being able to show all their strength and is also a good way to recruit more guards because uh, the, those that are the strongest usually uh, wow. get recruited as guards especially since a lot of people like there's quite a shortage of guards so I've... this tournament is also something that kind of makes the the thing pushed, and is usually held around. Uh, is it either uh, a bit outside of the capital or uh, in the forts in the north, uh, okay. perhaps even in the stone guard sometimes? Hmm. Well, uh, yeah, that's interesting. Um, uh, I've yeah, I've probably heard of this then. Oh yeah, you've I've, definitely I've heard of it. I'm a guard. Uh, yeah, uh, I'd, I'm kind of interested in that myself. Uh, well, you should, uh, you should go and, and, and do it yourself. I heard that this year they're going to make it as a 2v2 team battle, essentially. Oh. Yes. And, uh, and I think that they are, go I heard rumors uh, that they're going to make, like, in, uh, if you win, uh, the prizes are going to be either a lot of money uh or specific uh magically crafted or legendary weapons or something like that Ooh. they're they're trying to make it very very cool you know that sounds and great. i and, and i'm all for it and, and ben says like i re i want to show off how strong i have become well uh i'm excited to be able to see you there yeah and if we fight against each other, may the, may the best win. Yeah. I'll go on easy on you, too. <laughs> oh, you don't have to go easy on me. I am yeah. much stronger now. If you say so, you know. Beth, Beth, uh, Beth goes like, Well, anyway, we have to go now. I, we don't want to bother you anymore. Come on, Ben. And it's she just grabs him by the ear uh, and, and, and drags him away. It's good to see you guys again. Uh, Bye. Have fun. Adios. Yeah. <laughs> they're, uh, they're cute, fun. I and spaced out for the while, last thirty yeah. seconds. That's fair. That tournament does sound really interesting, though. It does. I definitely, I remember. Maybe that. we uh, should go. I think Does it offer I'd money. Definitely like to go. Uh, yeah. There's four of us uh, here anyway. I, uh, I'm well, not do sure you... you can fight too, Lisa, but four of us two can. Two. The tournament is like I two weeks. Am... Mm. Keep that in mind. Well, the tournament, actually, they, they can tell you. Uh, today is the 41st of fall. The tournament is going to be on the 52nd. 
So in, in 11 days. Ah, so there's time to invite Avery, who's probably gonna say no. <laughs> Sorry, my thing, my Wi-Fi was being really bad. I didn't hear of it. Um, uh, bring Avery to this to this fucking combat thing. <laughs> anyway, want to go barbarian on everyone. Us and it's a two v two. I think. Mm. Well, I don't know where it's being held this year, so Unless we should probably Avery look at as... whenever it gets. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that is some time right. still. Avery, they're all talking about you, even if you're there. You don't. They don't really know. Uh, right. Hey, Lisa, you you want to go to the tournament? <laughs> Lisa, I, I don't know if she's exactly combat trained. Yes. Leave yeah. Her, um, just yeah. leave her be. I think. Yeah. Lisa, you don't seem combat ready. Yeah. Adventuring. No combat experience at all. Ah, oh, don't worry, don't worry. We just like roughhousing. So I, oh yeah. You can use oh. your body as a weapon. Cedar, don't what? say it. Something like that. That's also, kinda, I don't know. Have you never what heard is of everyone? People? What is everyone passive perception? Uh oh. Um, I believe it's like seventeen. 18. Uh, Mark, 13. I think. I 18. think probably like eleven. I'm not sure. Okay. Not high. Eighteen, you said, right? Yep. Eighteen. Christ. You notice. Uh, you know, in those whole conversation with people chit chatting about how you can you you you. you, you okay. While, while making jokes about jokes statements about how you can use your body as a weapon, your eyes catches something. Your eyes catches a part of the city where no one is around, not even guards. Part of the town, a little bit far away, and you can see <laughs> one single house. Wow. Hmm. Ag. Huh? It's not too far. Ag? From. Oh! It appears we've wandered to the north side of the city. Well, look at that! That uh, you think that's her house? It's I mean, Aaron. it's a pretty singular, lonely house. I don't know. It could just be a random house, like. Well. Well, it doesn't ever hurt to visit some elderly woman, does it? Now. Well, we can just keep her company. Visit. You can give her the love potion. <laughs> we can give her the love potion and have her still at the door. She falls in love with the Roy. <laughs> yeah. You remember that the, per- the person has to know you, has to have an uh, understanding of who fair. you are. So She'll you have to first, you know, someone. introduce Noroi. Yeah. Watch her be Noroi's grandma. <laughs> Perhaps you don't know. That's why she's Suspish. so old. Yeah. I generally don't know what they meant by the teacher. Do you think we should uh, talk to this lady? Why not? She's been abandoned by everyone around. I think she feels a little lonely. He's already uh-huh. walking there. Apparently she feels a little crazy, but... <laughs> crazy never hurt anybody. Just look uh, at me! Wouldn't you rather Make sure he doesn't die. Hey. You want to go there? I'm going. I'll follow. The festival instead of bothering Reluctantly. Home. I think that would be a better idea. Good point. We're just gonna say hi. At least I am. I don't know about you. Well, we uh, can't let you go alone. I've handled myself before. But if you want to tag along, be my guest. Are you going, Arthur? Yes. Okay. I'm following. You're going. You're following along, <laughs> or you're leaving him go alone. I'm following. Follow. Reluctantly following. Okay. I debate whether to follow, but I, I will. Okay. <laughs> you go there, and uh, you see the house. It's quite not in the best condition. Uh, uh, not like it's broken or anything, but it's kind of like. Mm, mm, mistreated essentially it's just the person that is not really taking too much care of it 
And on on the door, there is like a plate that should be something like the family name, and it's kind of faded. Uh, giving it a closer look, you can see that it goes like this. You cannot see much about it, but apparently what you can see is essentially this, th th these remnants of the world, of the world. Cassius. Hmm. Uh, it's a yeah. house. Hmm. I knock. You knock. There seems to be no movement inside. Is it so passes like 10 seconds when you see coming from behind the door in what it seems to be a very kind of shitty garden an old woman screeching something like what are you want i'm going to uh, get the shit scared out of me <laughs> quick question what were the rumors about her that, well she's crazy but she uh, apparently used to be a very powerful maid she was Albridge's teacher. Teacher? Albridge's teacher. I believe that was. Yeah. Oh. Who are you? What are you oh, doing I'm here? I'm just a passing person. We're the. The unnamed adventuring party. Adventurous party? I don't want to know anything about you. I Go want away. to ask you about magic. Magic. You like magic, right? Right? Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> you wanna see some sick magic? No. Please don't. Why not? Uh, are you are you being are you saying the truth? Are you I you are thieves, aren't you? You want my house? <laughs> I have a mom. No, no. Absolutely not. All I want is to be strong. You are liars. Do I look like a liar? Liars. You see, her eyes light up with a blue light. Oh, oh no. no. Yes! I see you, Changeling. <laughs> what? <Liar. gasps> Angel, what? The what? Huh? So poor. <laughs> Terrible sickness, yes. But perhaps Ooh. she can help you. She, she's looking straight at you, uh, oh. Lisa. Perhaps she can help you. The savior. Uh. What? Avery. Angel? Start. It looks at you, uh, Cedar. Avery starts. Trembling. You. The, you can see the lights in her eyes shift for a moment and then goes back blue, bright. And you, so terribly alone, attached to the crumbs you have left. She doesn't remember you, no, but she's out there. She looks at you, Salt Paul. Fighting for so hard for a smile, aren't you? It's useless. That smile was denied. Denied, I say. Looks at you, Luna. Oh gosh. <laughs> so afraid of what happened in the past. I wonder. <laughs> I wonder what was under your feet. And then looks at you, Noroi. Uh oh. Whispers. Isn't that right? Whisper in the head. She gets closer. Whispers that about? keep humming. <laughs> what if he was never gone? The lights fades away and goes like. What are you doing still here? Go away! <laughs> and she goes back in the house. Back here, away! We should leave. Lisa's fucking but who's off. her? 
What do you mean, changeling? What are you talking about with the voices? The whispers? Who oh, have you off. been forgotten I'm about? Gone. Huh? Hey, come back here! Yeah, I'm gonna just go in a random direction. Don't really care where. I just don't yeah, want same. to be near this fucking house. Peter <laughs> is I want to get stock still. Wait, we're at like the edge of the town, right? Yes. I Pretty go much. away from the town. You go away from the town. What I'm maybe? not leaving. You're still there. You're going randomly in a direction. What about the others? I'm leaving. Die. You're leaving Cedar where? Cedar is dumbfounded. Just going somewhere. You're going somewhere. You too? Cedar is too, like, I don't... Shocked to move. Oh, you two are standing still, and, and you can see her, the the, the 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 old lady, like like peeking from the door. What are you doing still here? I don't want anything from you. You're thieves. You're liars. <laughs> what are hey, you? Yes. Hey, Grandma. I what? said that I have some magic, right? I don't care. I can prove it. Oh, I don't care. I don't want to see magic. Fight you can see that she start. She start. She start getting anxious. Oh. I don't magic. Magic. The eyes. The eyes. The eyes. The eyes. The eyes. The eyes. She close the door. From inside, you Sarah. hear muffled. Hi. Well done. Eye, the eye. The eye. Eyes are blue. Uh, is there? A tree nearby. Oh my yes. fucking god. <laughs> no, no. Oh god. Don't. I know what. There is a tree. There is a tree. It's not that. Okay. He is going to. He is going to. Sokpa's mad. Real mad. He is going to rage and punch that tree. Roll me an attack roll. Alright. Fail. Uh, an so unarmed strike was. is just. It's oh, usually a strike. Strike. So, same as your normal attacks. You take yeah. you 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 punch the tree and you just kind of hurt your hand a little bit, but not nothing that deals damage. Yeah, and he is raging. So. Yeah, yeah. Should I roll on the the eights? No, 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 no. It's, oh, no. it's just that. No. Is what type of environment is this city in? This like, city uh, is kind of like. Farmlands, plains, couple of trees, mostly plain okay. and, and a little bit of hilly. Okay. What eyes? I don't know what to do. I. Did any of that mean? Madam, you know things. Have you have you understood what what the hag said to you specifically? Like a, any of, of you? Course. Have you heard your part? Oh yeah. Yes. I understand, of course. Okay. That's why he's. Just want to make sure. That's why I left. Yep, me too. Cedar just wants to know more. So far, she's going still inside. To... So far, is looking at her. I don't know. I feel like if I tried to, if I annoyed her enough, she just like magic blast me. <laughs> she seemed to think she didn't like magic. <laughs> but she's clearly magical. Yeah. Cedar? I don't know about you, but I am not leaving. She knows something, and I want to know it. That's gonna come fuck? out. He's he's he is shitting at her door. He's not leaving. <laughs> mm. He's throwing a fucking he's gonna... tantrum. He's throwing a tantrum. He's not leaving. <laughs> he's he's gonna turn back to the house and just yell, "You're either gonna come out and talk to me, or I'm gonna be sitting here until you oh, have yeah. to." Calm down. You heard what she said. 
I won't let an old hag say that all of my effort is for nigh. He's planted on the ground. He's not leaving. The, the hag peeks again. Looks at you. You're still here. Go away. Not leaving! Why, why do you want us to go away so bad? It's my house. Jeez. And you are here to steal my stuff. What stuff? The house is falling apart. It's not. You hesitated. No, you know like I'm right. Horribly paranoid. Ah. The trees. The twin trees. She closed the eyes again. Uh oh. Twin tree, that's Wind tree. familiar. Cedar? What happened to you? <laughs> Madam, are you okay? I will be okay when you're gone. <laughs> Frankly, I think you're just gonna drive yourself further into madness. <laughs> Oh my god, I fucking died. <laughs> this is uh, uh, retro, for your information. This is the uh, <clears throat> finger reader kind of character that I yeah, made. Yeah, I thought so. How many trees are there here? I have, the, I think I have most of the most of the poems down in my notes, but I'm not here. I, yep. I have it. I have it. I can fucking DM it to you, Luna. Question. I have some of it because someone still refused to give it to us. <laughs> I'm not pissy know? about it. What do you mean? But fucking what do you know about strength? Strength? What you mean? <laughs> no, that, that well, I thought, it. <laughs> you know, I generally thought that would like trigger something from you. No. Strength, no. I have one I haven't shared yet, obviously. Yeah, but well, we have two. We have we don't have yet. Yeah. Well, you have technically one in your pocket. I need. You still magic. didn't read. So. Yeah, the thing. Okay, the thing is, Noroi has all but one, right? Avery has all but one, which is the one that Noroi has, <laughs> and the rest of us. Have all but two because you two are pieces of shit. <laughs> you asshole. Those Cedar keep screaming at the ash. What do you want from me? I'm gonna call the guard. <laughs> no, Have you no. removed my my property? Get off my lawn. What? <laughs> the house is falling apart. Calm <laughs> down. The house is not falling. Apart, I told you it doesn't look the best, but it's not falling apart. He's not smart enough to realize that. Yeah, okay. The body's dead and it's perfect. The silence is perfect, to be honest. Yeah, the uh, silence is fucking I'll perfect. Keep the, I'll keep it dead then because the fucking song I was using decides not to. You have some sort of gift. No. Gift? What do you mean, gift? What the heck did you do with those eyes? I, I. What eyes? No, I never eye. mind. Forget the eyes. I said anything. The eye. The eye. The eye. No, no. Blue. It's blue. It's looking at me. It's blue. It's looking at me. Bleak witness is looking at me. Blue. The blue is looking at me. Mind. My mind. Albridge, stop. I cannot do it. Yeah, but they ask her about Albridge, but she did it for us. She did it for us. She knows him. She knows. Are you cursed? Cursed? Hmm. What? What do you mean, cursed? You you act like you you're in pain. You act like you're. What do you some mean? Sort of I don't. Outside I'm not... force. What? Is you, what, what do you, you. you mean? You know. I don't understand. Us. You just know what? In pain about eyes. I never did that. Oh my god, you're actually possessed. <laughs> He's 
poor old lady. Or you just have like some oh, absolute like some kind of illness. Outsiders. Leave me alone. How did you know about our lives? How did you know that? I don't know I don't anything about knows. you. I don't think she knows anything. I think something else know that. What is the other the, the tree gone pe people doing? What are I'm you doing? Running somewhere to be sad. <laughs> you you find a corner where there are no people around. Okay, so I'm gonna sit there and cry. You know what? This is a perfect way to roll a d6. Ooh. Four. Let me check who's four. Let me fucking try to fix the bot. <laughs> oh, that's either really good or really bad. Oh, it's no. so, it's so perfect. If yes, you don't believe it, I'm gonna screenshot it. Okay. <laughs> I'm 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 actually gonna screenshot it. Hit it. Oh my fucking god! No! <laughs> I don't so, get it. This is <laughs> terrible. No. Are you famous? This is the. I want to say this is the same form she used to deliver the gold the first time. So, oh, you are. You're crying. What are you going on with you? And you can see him is going around with, with a couple of people behind him, probably bought a lot of stuff or something like that, or bringing stuff. You don't really know. Yeah. What did he ask? What's going on, right? Yeah. Nothing. I'm fine. Well, you surely don't look fine. So, how is the money collecting going? So it's not going the best. Well, as much as you may not believe me when I'm saying this, it's good that you're taking a day off and get properly rested. Uh, uh, this is going to be sound a little bit rude, but you're more useful alive than than that, and surely overworking yourself is not going to help. Also, I am kind of founding this event, so. Oh. It's also a little a bit of a win for me. Mm. Anyway, enjoy your uh, cry time, I guess. Uh, tell your dad that I say hi. Then he goes away. He did not make anything better. <laughs> <laughs> oh, absolutely. <laughs> Being another stress point. <laughs> yeah, fuck yeah, baby. We're at two. I just need one more. Oh, oh God. I really want that third okay. stress point. So okay. 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 Uh, roll me a perception check to see w w if you can find them. Okay. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh my god! You find them. You find them. Oh my uh, you stroll around, and at some point, you find your parents. Uh oh. What you want to do? Hey. Oh, look, why are you alone? Are you okay, son? No. Something wrong? What um, happened? This fucking bot. We... We went to the house in the north. Oh, the crazy hag. I heard about her. Yes. So apparently, there's a rumors that she was like this kind of wizard. I think it was divination or something. Well, that makes sense. She... She looked at me and Definitely talked about divination. <laughs> whispers in the head. I mean, and I uh, wouldn't surprise me considering. No, that... but what? Also talked about how well they never left and they're not gone and 
What did you say? It's no, nothing. Sure, but tell me, please. What's going on? It's 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 all right. I just calm down. Your dad like puts a hand on your shoulder. Hey, whatever is troubling you, you can tell us. Okay. No, this is Lord of the Rings. Just just let it out. You don't have to bear more weight than you should, you know, than anyone should. You can share it with your family. Are you okay? Did you send anything else? I'm just... What if she's talking about... You know... I mean... Whispers. Not not just that, but also the other thing. Not being gone. Not being gone? I, I, I didn't understand correctly. So you mean... Oh... You you think it, it, it? She means. I I'm I'm not sure. I... Listen, listen. It's okay. It's okay. She's called the crazy hag after all. She's not saying anything serious. You can see your mom starts crying heavily. Like she's not even hiding it. She's probably just spouting nonsense. Since and, and and so just just don't think about it and and I don't, don't think it's nonsense. Uh, uh, let's 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 just uh, you, 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 your dad hugs both of you. It's okay. It's okay. Whatever happened, whatever she said. Whether it's true or not, we don't know. And if it's not, and I, to be honest, I think it's not. It's it's like always. It's like we it's any normal day. Sometimes clinging to hope is a little bit foolish. Sometimes it's the only thing we can do. But. Is there anything, if there isn't the remote possibility that what she said is true, I will pull every string that I have to make sure that I know. Okay? Okay. Thanks. This is... This is a lot. I know. Don't worry. Don't worry, okay? Yeah. <sighs> Where are your okay. friends? Some of them... Friends, by the way. Some of them are still there, I think. Others went... Went away on their own. I guess you didn't really hold anything back with any one of you, huh? No. Listen. For what I know, and uh, I, haven't, I know quite a lot in these regards, she was supposed to be this kind of powerful wizard back in the day. We're talking about years and years and years ago, okay? We're talking about before the fall. Mm. I don't know if anything is related to, you know, what happened with, with, uh, with Maurice Stern or whatever happened with Albridge. I don't know. What I know is that it was supposed to be a really strong mage. And at some point, she disappeared. Mm. When she came back, she was like this. That's all I know. Uh, 
But if there's anything more that I can understand, I will make sure to know it. For okay. what we know right now, and please keep this in mind, for what we know right now, she's just a crazy old ma- woman. She is just a crazy old woman. Yep. Don't cling too much to hope. I know. And don't worry. I will make sure to investigate this thoroughly, okay? Mm-hmm. Thank you. You don't have to take me. I know. <sighs> <sighs> now, try to... Try to help your friends as well, okay? I will. Anything else you would like to do? Just one... One last hug, and then I ch- try to go try to find the others. Okay. You find... Uh, at some point, you can notice that there is um, a Lisa, quote-unquote, uh, in, in one street that seems to be in shambles completely. <laughs> hey. Um... She looks up, her eyes just kind of red, tears running down her cheeks. Just this, this ab, this look of, this, she just looks distraught. Do you, you want to talk or just? I'm going to. I'm gonna DM you, both you and Ken, because Ken obviously is gonna yes. DM what she says, because this is an undercommon. She doesn't want anyone else to know this. Okay. Uh, let me. I'll DM it to Ken first. Yes, please. Yes. Okay. <laughs> oh. <sighs> I don't know. Do you I um I'm going to approach and just uh Hug. She she accepts it. Hugs you back. She just she's just kind of not in a good place. <laughs> oh, un- understandable to be honest. I mean, you get you get trauma slapped in your face, and then the guy that you owes money it just just slaps you again. <laughs> this is. Fucking double whammy out this bitch. We love to see it. Double trouble. Yes. Yeah. She's gonna be there crying. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I do have to ask. You still there? Or are you doing anything else? Okay. Looking at the at, at the vastness of the world. You too? What about you too? This music is perfect if they decide to fight the hag. My <laughs> <What> question. <laughs> I'm not fighting Let's her. Go. She's like a twenty wizard. Take an old woman. No. <laughs> well, I can take her. She's They're most certainly wise. a level. Tw- 20, I'm not that fighting. Nerd, nerd, not fighting, boys. We can take her in another way. Oh my fucking Arthur, god. Sit down. No. <laughs> what is your name? That's exactly, I mean, she's kind of hot. Exactly. What? Hot. <laughs> anyway, Shut um. Up. What is your name? My. 
I might... I... Uh... I don't know. Leave me alone. Hmm. Fine. Seems like our presence here just prolongs your pain anyways. But one oh. last question. Do you know where the savior is? The savior? What's that savior? You know, the crown dragon. Crown dragon. Crown dragon. Phyllis. Crown dragon. No, Alberich, don't do this, Alberich. It's too much. I'm so sorry for you, Alberich. It's unjust. You had to do it. Why are you? Why are you doing so much? Why are you trying so hard? Ah. <sighs> This is dangerous. No, I don't know any crown dragons. What you mean? What is crown dragons? Twin trees. Your, your mind like fractured. I what what does that mean? I don't know. Well, you know about the twin trees, the house of the twin trees. The house. The twin trees, what? Twin trees. Eh, twin trees. I. Uh, 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 my head hurts. My head. Okay, okay. My head, Hazel, please help me. Hazel, where are you? I think she's going to like die. She's fine. She'll be fine. She'll live this long. A she little practically bit has Alzheimer's so far. Hazel. She'll be fine. I'm so no, sorry. Not. Listen, a little bit of back and forth is not gonna kill her. I've been doing this for a while this. now. It's fine. We just need to keep prodding. We're already getting some things. Now we have a Hazel and whatever about the name she said. I go right down. Are you just mad at her? Well, duh. But that doesn't mean that, that doesn't mean anything. Don't. I, my memory is so fucking bad. But listen, she knows something. We are looking for his wish. She knows something. She can help us. We Honestly, to... not sure if she knows something or if it's something else. Well, something in her head knows something, and she is the mouth for it. Do you have whispers? And I Do turn I? to the hag. Whispers? What you mean, whispers? whispers Go off my house! Why are you still here? What's no, I don't head? have whispers in my hand. What What do you mean? Hmm. Just a hunch. I think there's more what than one mean? hag in her There's just me. And how many you are there? Me. What do you know about the savior? Who is the savior? The savior of what? Phyllis. 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 That doesn't... that's not familiar. It is. It is? No, it's not. It's not. Yes, it is. Hold on. Hypothetically, if it was familiar, what would you know? I don't know. 
I don't even know who I am. Yeah, that sounds about right. Do you need help? Get off my alone! Oh. Get off my arms! You know, if the savior is a healer, perhaps she can heal you. I don't need any healing. I'm perfectly fine. Pretty sure that you need healing. You definitely need healing. I don't. Aren't you alone right here? I have everything I need. What do and you what? have in your house? What do you Everything I need. Great. We have everything we need, too. Ah. Uh, but the, the only thing we're missing is a lovely old grandma. Leave me alone. Why? You like animals. Being alone is... I... Eat them. <laughs> you have right, friends? Then. I was gonna try to befriend you with, like, like summoning a monkey or something, but okay. Friends. I have. I had. I. Who are you? I'm well, no. Cedar Cypress. So Cedar Cypress. So Soapball. Oh, my name is I uh, 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 cause uh, no, I don't know. I need to pull that thing from Avatar where they freaking like used water healing water magic to help somebody that was brainwashed. It was not. She opens the door again and peeks. Why are you still here? Go away. We want to know more about you. We're fans. He don't need you. And closes still. the door, shuts it down. I'm still here because I just want to help. I don't need it. I am fine. Because you don't need help doesn't mean can't be helped. Hazel. Hazel, does that Hazel. name ring any bells? Hazel, no. She's just... She's... I cannot... I could not... And, and, and... And she... She will deliver the message. She will. Don't worry, she will. Okay? Message. What are you doing, you two? Have you calmed down a bit? She... By being heard much She... She nods a little bit. Do you want to go find the others? Or stay here? <laughs> what did you say? Uh, uh, I need to yeah, uh, retro. Do you uh, want me to go then, or? She. She waits. A, she. She waits a bit. Okay. 
All right. I'll stay with you then. Are you sitting down on the ground? Yes. Okay. That 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 puzzle thingy is is not the most comfortable to have in your bag, Am but I... uh, uh, you can you, you yeah you, you can see it. I mean, it's no problem. No, no. Hmm. I'm gonna fucking move it around my bag so it's not fucking sticking against my ass or some shit. Okay. Anything else you would like to do? I'd like to action cry. A little bit. Less okay, you can do still that. Still doing it. It's just, a, it's just a little bit less now. Okay. Then, if that's your action, let's go back to this, guys. You like food? <laughs> we have syrup! I have the greatest maple syrup money you can buy. Okay, absolutely. I don't like sweet things. What do you like, then? You Cedar off my loan! brings out a dagger, no. Don't you like, uh... Salty things? Mm, no. Ocean salt. I don't like anything. Oh, well, that's a given. Also, uh, you notice uh, a couple of guards coming near. Uh oh. Uh, sir. Uh, excuse me, but we have hearing. Uh, we've been hearing a lot of shouting and and. And noise is coming from here, and it's worrying a couple of the people here at the, uh, the, you know, festival. Is it everything okay? Are you checking for the, the hag? We're having a lovely chat with her. I would ask you to uh, go away from the house. She is, um, I understand she may have angered you. Uh, it happens a lot, apparently, for some reason. With everyone she talks with. Uh, just... I hope considering that she's still a uh, citizen. Those guards being good guards. Can I ask you a question? Who? The, the guard. Okay, yes. Okay, so. Can I ask you a question, sir? Yes. Is... She's an old lady. Yes. And she's a, from a place we could tell she's living here alone. How is she being taken care of? I think she's... She does everything by herself. What about... We don't really know. And I don't know how she gets her food and water from? I mean, the water is... The, the, the river is not too far from here. She has a well, and I'm pretty sure she has a garden with vegetable. And one time I also saw her eating a raw bird. Like, she looked like a beast. But that's kind of strange. I, don't, I hope it's not the regular mazes. But apparently she can well take care of herself. And no, don't get me wrong, I, I don't wish a, a harm to anyone. But she's like... More than 80 at this point. And for a human, it starts to become a little quite old. And uh, if anything happened to her, we would assist. But I'll be honest and terribly blunt. If she was gone, this town was probably going to be a little bit more, uh, feeling a little bit better, considering how she's this renowned, weird person. But she's not harming anyone. So, I have to defend her like I have to defend anyone else. So I have to ask you to go away from her property. It's not like we're gonna try to attack an old lady. I don't, you know, harassing a person 
doesn't have to come for in it doesn't have to uh, take a form of a, a physical attack it can also be something like this Say and from the inside of the door, you, oh, the how do you say, go away? <laughs> Fine, we're going, we're going. Yes. Yes, go away. Yes. Ruin Talon. Go away. I'm gonna turn to the officer and just. Well, you heard what I said to her. Okay. Me. Have a nice day. Enjoy your festival. Yes, thank and... you. And I hope you can enjoy the festival as well. We we've had plenty of fun. Thank nice. you for the. For Cedar is just been staring event. straight at the hag, unblinking for the past minute. And the, the, the hag is inside, so I guess you're staring at the door. Come on, Cedar. Let's let's go for now. Cedar narrows his eyes, but he follows. Hmm. You walk slowly towards the street until you find a couple of people not really be being silent and sad. Very, ah. very. Well, look who's back. Well, that was fun. <laughs> I wouldn't call it that. I hate you too. What, you, what, you don't think having an existential crisis is fun? Ow. Existential crisis, crises are fun. Not when they make me feel angry. He... By the way, he has his shirt open. Oh yeah, he's feeling hot. He's feeling okay, hot. I wanna, ask, I wanna ask now. Hot uh, and bothered. Anatomy. Do do Kitsune have multiple nipples? No. Okay, good. You don't see any nipple. Oh, it's nice. It's yeah. covered by the fur. It's furry. It's entirely furry chest. Furry abs, yes. Also, uh Lune, uh Luna, are you doing anything? <laughs> You're still there. Just staring at the void. Oh, this is a good time to... Ow. Have something out. This is a Luna moment. Okay, you're just staring at the void. Okay. Luna is being... Uh, and having her main character moment. I want to take out back. the staff. And I want to summon a little... Let's say a bluebird to find Luna. Okay. Uh, as you weave the staff and, and the bluebird appears, as I tell, told you, it's, trans, it's transparent and, and it's shimmering light, essentially. It looks like it's made of constellations. Okay? And it's transparent, so you can see uh, in between. But you managed to create this bird with no problem. Go bring... Do I, like, telepathically talk with it? How does this work? Uh, you can command to it. You can talk with it. Just straight up talk. I mean, like, if I told it to bring back Luna, would it know who Luna is? <laughs> if you know her, it knows her. It's a spell Alrighty. that you created, so yes. Okay, so that's how it works. Yeah, I tell it, little friend, go bring back Luna. And the verb goes. And you can see the, the verb just going up in the sky trying to scout for Luna. Uh, you can roll me uh, uh, a perception check. Uh, actually, you can roll me a d20 plus 3 with advantage. Okay. Depending on the role, is going to take a, a little or a lot of time. So, you'll see. Well, yeah, the burbs go. So, guys, you feeling great? Feeling they still on the ground. Amazing. 
You don't. Mm, oh, same yeah. here. Yeah, Lisa's, Lisa's still just sitting down. Kind of fetal position, knees against her chest, facing her knees. You know what it is. Papa's gonna sit next to you. Just I'm also just sitting there. And okay. That was a lot. And I yeah. try to keep my face um, as neutral as possible again. Can we tell he was crying? Yeah, it's probably. Oh. Okay. Yo, really affected, huh? That was mild. Now just imagine if Avery was there too. My god. Oh, oh, <laughs> About that. Huh. So. She meant to do changeling, but there are a lot of changelings. They're not too uncommon. He's, he's gonna ask about that. So. Which one of you is the changeling? <laughs> What's that are shoot? you... Are you serious? <laughs> hey, I want to ask. <sighs> That's why he looks so young. <laughs> He's half changeling. <laughs> well, do you want to my finally reveal it? Yeah, I'm not really gonna. She's her. Her colors just kind of seem to melt away as everything on her just becomes this neutral gray. She's still in ah. Lisa. Like, she's still Lisa's form because, well, she fucking changes her body. Her clothes won't fit. Yeah. So. Yeah. <laughs> but now it's like everything is just this flat shade of gray. Ah. Uh. This explains oh. nothing. This explains nothing. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least now we know that Leroy isn't the changeling. Actually, now that I think about it, why are you walking with us? Hmm. Wait, wait a minute. It's you your say? date. <laughs> no. <laughs> she, she is not. And what gave you that idea? Well, you just walked in with a. With a girl that we don't know, and suddenly you're on friendly, friendly terms. Oh my god, is she your wife? I don't have a wife. Don't tell no. me you seduced a little girl, Neroy. Oh my god. It's even worse. <laughs> she, that is disgusting. She does not disgusting. look like a little girl. She looks mature. I don't think... Neroy is odd, but he's not that kind of odd. Think? Mm. Nope. Oh my god. If you are, I'll kill you. I'll just need you to know that. I am very much not interested in anyone at the moment. Alright, good to know, good to know. <laughs> not yet. <laughs> I to Go on. Love I potion it. intensifies. No, I'm gonna fucking burn that. <laughs> <laughs> it's with me. <laughs> good luck taking it. So, uh, if she's not your lover, who do we know? Harry's not paying attention to the shit you guys are saying right now. He's My just kinda... gosh. <laughs> He's just kinda... Do we know Avery her? is an alien! <laughs> What the? Where the fuck did You're that come from? Where did that come from? What does that have to do with this? So, so changelings are aliens. Well, the thing is, Laura, you even brought out a stranger to walk around the city with us, 
or this is someone we know in a form we know. Yes, you know her. That is what I said from the very beginning. So you did. So who are you? Oh my fucking god. How many changelings do you right. know? None! <laughs> can you not get- changeling. can you not add the one plus one to get the so, two? Paul, roll me an insight. <laughs> This dude, he, rolled, okay. he fucking made one plus one and got one still. What the fuck? Yeah. He is dumb, alright? He roll is low. dumb. Roll a 13. You 13. you look at her and you go like, ah, but what the fuck are you? And then goes like, oh, oh, oh. Yeah, mm. you. You kind of have a, a little bit of a realization. You're not sure, though. You could be very but, much wrong, but you had a little okay. bit of a realization. Okay. It so, could be thing. Avery, but you're not sure if it is. Yes, exactly. But that. he is going to bring something up. But why would you choose to be that small? <laughs> that height is a very normal height. Just... <laughs> You're that. small too. <laughs> Wait, it matters what small you're talking about. Her normal small or this small? Her normal small. <laughs> okay. Uh. In a... No shame on someone who's born like that or wants yeah. to stay like that. It's just she was born if you cannot, way. if you cannot, why do you choose to stay? Huh? Loaves are expensive. <laughs> it draws less attention. That's what she says. You're harder to see when you're that small. It's easier to hide. Uh, hmm. Plus, Fair point. Yeah. Hmm. If I could change my shape, what size would I be? Double mine. Definitely dumb. Large size killed Paul. Twelve feet this... tall. Isn't that a bit too tall? Taller, stronger. I can protect you better. Huh. Clearly I failed the last time. Hmm. I wanna... I'm gonna start... Wiping away at my tears. Right. Her. She's still this, just like flat shade of gray. But her eyes go back to her usual color, right? Which you can now notice one is yellow and the other one is violet. So she just looks like Lisa, but an Avery color palette. <laughs> ah! So anyway, hell? I don't want to be here anymore. I don't want to nah, go me home. We can go. Let's just wait for, for Miss Luna. You two can go on ahead. Can go. You two can go on ahead. We'll just wait for Luna and reconvene with you at the gate. Luna! A bird! appears before you and it seems to be made of light and it chirps light bird look up slowly it, it it chirps it looks at you and and attempts to peck you but it just passed through you so it just doesn't do anything you cedars chirps go back to him um Leave me alone. Oh. Text you again. <laughs> <laughs> it, again, it cannot hurt you. On my own time. It only Leave takes orders from me. Alone. Birds is... It goes away. 
hunch back down, look at the horizon, stay there. Okay. Was it that I'm the only one that was not affected by this? <laughs> because you're a cedar, you're edgy boy. You're used to this. I'm used to sadness. <laughs> you're used to trauma. This is a very interesting arc for a cedar, honestly. Yeah. yeah. Everyone else. I hope. Easily. I hope that this this little thing, uh, spice thing, comes. Oh, it is. Yes. Mm-hmm. Uh, Ken, I got I'm gonna have definitely. to let the shit out of this stream. Because I have so I many just theories, got to but spill like... a little bit of lore that I've been wanting to spill, even if it was just in DMs. I'll spill it. I'll spill some tea, Ah. Uh... <laughs> and yes, as much as he tried to push this, this was optional. But yeah. Uh... So you you can now imagine that a, a lot of other optional things can be of this importance. Mm hmm. Looks at our babies that are somewhere in the world or dead. Mm. Okay, so, anything so... you're doing in this particular moment? I'm just. I, I'm, I'm just kind of. You know what I really want now? Pacing around, hugging myself, just kind of. Waiting for Luna because, well, I was told that we have to wait for her before we can leave. Can leave. I, 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 you said you can leave, and we can just come back, catch up with you later. Yeah. The birds come back, and uh, like essentially, place itself on your finger, but it's actually just overing. It's not actually touching your finger because it cannot. And looks at you, Cedar. And shakes his bird head. Hmm? It just shakes his hmm. bird head. Seems kind of sad. Casts speak with animals. What is it? Is Luna is it okay? No. Said that we'll come back when 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 she wants to. Mm. She's not doing fine. Needs time alone, I think. Mm. Damn, I wish you could carry letters. <laughs> I can. Not as busy. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Poor bird. You did good. Thank you. I am an illusion. And he puffs away. <laughs> <laughs> was, that, <laughs> was that like I love illusion bird? Or was that like <laughs> yeah. just realization Create like, oh, life shit, and I'm illusion. It. <laughs> or was it, was, it, was it just saying, I'm an illusion? Did we just illusion fucking birds. fuck up this bird's entire perception of life? It doesn't exist anymore, so you don't know. God damn it. <laughs> yeah. did, I just, did I just create a consciousness and then kill it? <laughs> Prof, that's what the staff truly does. What the? Okay. What did this say? I think that upsets me more than whatever just happened with the hag. <laughs> uh, I made life and murdered it. Told us, told me that To be fair, Luna... you got probably the most positive thing. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> the love potion is the most useful. I don't know what you mean. <laughs> Alright, everyone restrain the Roy. We need some fun. No, no, no excuse me. What happened? Wait, 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 why did we start talking about love potions? Yeah, he was uh, talking about the, the vision thing the bitch had. Yeah. 
saying how Cedar got the most positive. Oh, yeah. The magic item. I thought you meant the magic <laughs> item is the most positive one. I was like, that love potion is the most positive one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, when you're back with restraining. Oh, so Cedar just kind of assumed what he was told. You, you can already DM assumed me if you, have, I, uh, if you have an idea. About what he was told? Yes. I mean, just to just to try and understand what you're thinking right now, if you don't want to tell it, say it. At some point, whilst Avery's pacing... I'm not going to tell you anything. I'm not going to confirm nor denying it. That's going to be... That's the fun part. Leave you in the darkness. Ah, the turmoil. Ah. Oh, shit. At some point, while Avery was pacing around, she just starts quickly flashing between Lisa's colors and her colors. Just... She's kind of like... Just quickly switching between them. Uh, you can all roll me a constitution save <laughs> to avoid having <laughs> um, <laughs> an yeah. attack, an epileptic attack. No, I'm joking. Let's I'm joking. Go. I'm joking. Let's go. This is how we roll, guys. <laughs> this old oh, mind okay. cannot handle it. Oh, oh my god. Oh, fuck. <laughs> and, um, yeah. Anything you would like to do? Eventually. Also, I suppose you still didn't read oh, it, there. but yeah. I guess you can take an achievement point oh, since you nice. found a clue. Yeah, I was planning on reading it once we got back to the, the tavern. Because, you can. Well, you don't really want to do that out in public. I mean, li just literally just the four of you now. Oh, yeah, true. I guess I can do it now. If you want. Yeah. She had nothing else to do. She's impatient. Maybe it'll maybe it will come. Uh, I will not make you roll anything because now you understood the combination of the lock. Nice. Uh, would you like it. to read it? She's not gonna read it out loud. She's not in a vocal mood right now. Okay. So should I give it just to you or should I still put it in the chat? Just to me. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. I okay. Uh, boy, I'm gonna give... And girl. I'm gonna give you... This, you're free then to share it with whatever, whoever you want. Okay. Uh, 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 let me actually find it, though, because I don't remember where they put it. Wait a second. Here it is. No, that's not it. Uh -oh. I have, like, seven documents open. Wait a second. Here it is. Let us see. Ooh. Mm. Mm. Like Avery was pacing back and forth. He saw her pull out the 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 little box that she bought from the from the strange man and just kind of started tinkering with it and it opened. She put the box, she took the thing out, put the box... Yeah, the thing is, once again, piece of paper folded, mm -hmm. uh, beautifully written with a stamp that uh, of authenticity with the crown dragon crest. She... She, you see her quickly read through it. Right. Her eyes just kind of scanning through it. And she stops. Mm -hmm. She's gonna give it to Noroi. Noroi, should I give it to you in the M or are you going to read it aloud? 
What do you think? DMs. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God, Noroi. No, he's not sharing anything on this. You have one broken and... arm, I'm gonna break the second. This time, you can't really blame Avery for it. No, you can't really blame Just... Noroi for it. I gave it to him, so... <laughs> You're gonna break Let's anything, see if, let's... Let's see if Noroi is changing his, uh, his non-team dynamic in a team dynamic. We'll yeah. see, we'll see. But uh, it's in, not in your DMs. I still don't know mm -hmm. that he kept one from us, so I'm not going to be a little bitch about it. No. Oh. Okay. Are you doing anything with it? No. Nope. Are you just keeping just... it? Well, I'm giving it back. Okay. Well, gonna... what does it say? I'm gonna fold it up, put it with the other ones I have, and start pacing again. <laughs> uh, so you ignore um, Slipon? I will not I'm gonna say it. Well, I won't say it. I gave it to I gave it to Neroy so he could say. It. <laughs> Okay. The question is, so was Okay. Do you want me to say it out loud? Asking me? Yeah. She will... think about it. Then she thinks about what the, the lady said. And she shakes her head no. Understood. I'm alive. We'll come well, back. They just kept us a, a clue from us. Again. You might want to hold me back. <laughs> back. Huh? Did you just... Uh... Was that a no? <sighs> oh, Golden Tail, please help. Uh, Noroi, you're mm -hmm. simply going to say no and nothing else about it, right? Yeah, I mean, Avery doesn't want me to share, so I'm not gonna... Are okay. you two serious right now? Avery's gonna jump when you yell. After all of that, Please, and no... Calm down. That's your second no, you don't get the talk. <laughs> we went to that hag and we had to, <laughs> I don't know, get all our secrets revealed for everyone else. Cryptically, maybe, yes, but we kind of, personally, I had something destroyed in me for a second. And after all that, we get that, he kind of gestures to the clue, and, and no. He has a point. That's your second no, Nuro. I don't have a problem with telling you. The thing is just that Avery doesn't want me to. He's going to just look at her. And your reason is... On my own. This was like, you can hear in her voice that she is honestly scared, but something in her is like, I need this. I'll wait for Luna to deal with you. Women deal with women. <laughs> Us for that? you. The first sexist in the universe. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. yeah. Arthur, you literally <laughs> created sexism in the universe. Well done. <laughs> the bad in no yeah. of these women and their hormones. I mean, I could technically just change genes if I wanted Babe. to. She's gonna. Uh, he's gonna. You can do that? I'm gonna change one. <laughs> Bro. He's I gonna turn to Roy. <laughs> And the first clue that you kept from us, would you like to share? 
I can... I can share. Be my guest. Not here, though. <laughs> Let's oh, golden wait. Trail. Until Miss Leona's back. She right. deserves to know, too. For once, I can agree with you on something. Your clue is coming out when Luna's back. That's an agree that everyone can stand witness to, correct? He's going to look at Cedar. This is down. I will have it saved. There we go. Great. He's gonna turn to uh, Avery. I don't know what your goal. I don't know what your goal to get the wish is for. All I know is either one of us, is any of us alone are not going to achieve it. If you want to go off hiding them and try to get it yourself, be my guest. Is it about the savior? Oh yeah. And that hag, after clearly she destroyed us all emotionally, she kept and... on talking. About... But he's gonna speak in a lower tone. Aldridge. Someone named Hazel. And a few other names. I don't know. She knows something we don't. Nice. Eyes, house of twin trees, two eyes, something blue shining on her. Feels as if her mind got fractured. Feels like her mind is jumping back and forth between wanting to say, wanting to know, and not. Something has broke her. We don't know what is. But she has something. She knows something. Now you, he is going to point to Noroi, are persuasive. So if you want to give it a try, or if you have someone who can give it a try, do it. You have to be careful. I can't just... Do it. I know. I mean, you almost got in trouble with the guards. But, as much as I hate to admit it sometimes, you're a smart man. Use it for once to not fight against your team. Because. Um... I would like to remind both of you. you, it feels like it, honestly, sometimes. It really feels like it. And that goes for both of you. He's going to go ask at Avery. Me, Luna, and Cedar have, surprisingly, talked things through. And actually gotten to a point where I can honestly say that they are my friends. Cedar blinks. Yes, I count you as a friend, sir. You two hmm. are as as close to me as any stranger on the street. And I've had my life in your hands for quite enough. So if you are either going to choose to trust me as much as I trust you, or... I am leaving this team. I admit, I had some trouble trusting all of you at first. Had? Yes, I think I can trust you more now, after all well, the things we've been through. Like I said, I I will share 
the things I kept secret. You just had to give me a little time. I understand your anger, but... I'm willing to cooperate. Cool. You have no idea how relaxed that makes me. Well, that's one mountain down. Looks at Avery. It's enough. She's still pacing. She is still pacing. Well, I'm glad we got a good time to relax at this festival. <laughs> oh, say Speaking sarcastically. Of the festival, do you think there's still some syrup left? Some of that premium. I might as well buy some myself. I never drank any of it. You're just gonna drink now, this fucking syrup? You're not even gonna put it on anything? No, we can How else do you consume syrup? You put it on pancakes! What's or... a pancake? <laughs> What's a pancake? Mmm... Cedar? Hmm? Here is the deal. You stay with these two and make sure that they don't uh, kill themselves. And I'm gonna go get some syrup. And hopefully, if you find Luna, wait for me. Right? <clears throat> Before Alrighty. anything of that happens, a mm -hmm. couple of people pass by. Familiar faces. Mm hmm. Is everyone at this fucking hey! festival? <laughs> it's the man. The man, the oh, myth, the legend. Boy. Adult Levi. <laughs> oh, look at this funny bunch of people. Hello. Oh. Hello. Hello. I have met you guys already, no. but seems like you are not a fool. You're you are you are Avery's friends, right? Yeah, that we are. Mm -hmm. yeah, I think. It's good. Well, uh just just seeing a little bit of the festival and uh thought I, I might find some adventures here, you know. Perhaps I advertise a little bit of the quest that I made. <laughs> I bet you've seen it. We've seen, seen it, yeah. yes. They were thinking about taking it, actually. I mean, to be honest, it is going to be dangerous. That's why I asked for help. So feel free to, you know, skip on that one. I understand that it can be a particularly challenging. But uh, if you ever feel like you, you want to join me in this adventure, I'll be looking forward to it. And I guess you can tell uh, Avery that I say hi. I will deliver that message. I'm sure she'll love to hear that. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> I mean, to be honest, I feel like he kind of scared her a little bit. To be honest, everyone scares her a little bit. <laughs> eh, could be, could be. She can be very strong. Oh, yeah. That she is. And surprisingly stubborn, too. I mean, who's, who isn't? Everyone has their own thoughts and own opinion. It's really hard for some time to just, just focus on how someone else may feel. Isn't it? That is, that is true. I think I, I'm just uh, used to thinking about someone else's feeling or lack thereof. But I can see why it's hard for someone else. Understandable, I guess. I mean, personally speaking, I don't really interact much with people. I only <laughs> have this core here that is always keeping me company, and he just smacks him really strong on the shoulder. He's unmoving and unsaying of anything, hey, like always. He's like me. Nice to meet you too, Core. You are a little... You are a little softer. Uh, he doesn't talk. Like, 
always, almost never. Don't worry. He, he, he <laughs> not. Core, just have a stare down. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna see if there's still some maple syrup. Uh, <laughs> see you guys. See you too. Have fun. See you. Look at all these NPCs. So many oh. people. So many. The twins. Hmm. Yeah. Well, that was a surprise. <laughs> Maybe once your arm is healed up, we can take their quest. They seem like the funny bunch. I think we should maybe take another quest instead. Get a quest, get a dark places. <laughs> it's not that. Mm. I just I rather avoid dying. <laughs> ah, you know what? Yeah, you have a point. I guess I just don't think about Good point. Living in health. Hmm. Well, regardless, that was a, that brought a hole to my plans, but now I can go. You guys stay here. You're going to check for maple syrup? Yeah. Is any left? You go and check for it. At the, mm. at the festival. Okay. You go and check and dress. There are some some bottles, especially of the one that costs a lot. How much a lot? Uh, there is one one bottle of the of the really the good one from Ten Service. That's that's five gold pieces. There's one mm -hmm. bottle of the of the really good one that is twenty five service and it's uh, ten gold pieces. I'll take one of the five gold pieces. Okay. And um while you're there you're um oh. it's kind of it's kind of disappointed that, that Lama just went away right in this moment because I guess he can roll a new one. Why? Why not? Oh, uh, you're taking we'll stuff, and at some point, you see there is this, um, you see something hitting your leg. Wait. And now, uh, oh. Ah. What the? Oh. Oh. oh my Such. god. It's the baby. Oh, man. Oh. Oh, my heart is the baby. <laughs> and, and, and. And you you hear um, a voice going like, "Pride, where are you going?" And oh, hello, you sir. see uh, a woman. Woman. Oh, cute. Women. Oh. We oh. like women here. Pride, come here. here. And he goes like, "I'm still. I'm sorry, sir. Sorry." No, <laughs> I I oh, recognize no. Pride. Yes. Yes. Um. <laughs> no worry. No worry. I know this guy. Excuse is... me. Do I do I know you? I don't recognize you, but I know that she is my teammate's sister, uh, Luna Luniper. Oh yes, Luniper. <laughs> Welcome back. Welcome Lama. back, Lava. <laughs> Here, yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I... Oh yeah, I yeah, Luniper. Uh uh yeah, I she has been going on an adventure. I didn't know you were the one of this of her teammates. <laughs> uh I didn't present myself. I am I'm Shayla and she's bright, you know her already. Uh yeah. I'm her that mom, I guess. Oh shit! Sure. Uh, well, well, she's uh, this one, and and pats her head. Uh, well, she's mine, but uh, yeah. Ah, 
Oh, I see. <laughs> nice to meet you, man. Nice to meet you um, too. I hope you're treating uh, uh, Luna with care. Family tree. I think she is having. She is saving my ass. <laughs> I mean, her father talks a lot about her. She is very strong. Yes. She is indeed. I mean, she I... used to be a guard and all. You know, she she worked at the stone uh, stone guards. I guess she mm -hmm. has to be one of the strong ones. She is. She is strong in more than one. She kneels down a little bit to to Bright, and her sister really likes when she comes back home to visit her. Oh. She is shy, but she really likes her big sister. Right, Bright? And Bright goes like, yes. <laughs> well, I'll let her know about that. Maybe we are taking a little bit of a break right now because of our team. Made being injured. Oh, so, I'm sorry um, about that. It comes with the job, so I guess that's true. Yeah. <laughs> I, oh. I, I I just I I just a teacher at a school. The most dangerous there are less complicated. Though one time a kid tried to bite me. That was Ugh. weird. Yeah, kids are evil. Uh, I've seen some things in my adventures. Kids are the scariest thing I know. <laughs> Bright looks at you with with confusion. <laughs> not you, not you. You are a good kid. Some kids are not though. Ah, oh. to be honest, I'm used to work with kids, and I don't know. I I just love working with them. Anyway, <laughs> nice to meet you again, and. Uh, Again, tell tell Luniper that I say hi, okay? She's welcome to come home whenever she wants. I'm I sure will... that her dad will love to see her. And right too. I will relay your message, don't worry. Yeah. It's unfortunate we could you couldn't meet her right now, but she's with the others. I just broke out the of the party to yeah. buy some of this. <laughs> oh, that's really good. Yeah. The normal one's not gonna taste the same once you've tasted the good one. <laughs> oh, I've heard. I've heard. Uh, it's um, uh, it's quite problematic, though, since it costs a lot. Uh, does damn does the I, I have... Does the little one here likes it a lot? And he's gonna pat Bright a little bit. Oh, Bright, she's she likes sweet things, but she she kind of likes everything as for now. So, I don't really know if she likes anything or she's just exploring. <laughs> An adventure, little kid. Anyway, we didn't have much time. We just wanted her to to bring her to look around, so... Yeah. It's, uh... We'll see. Yeah, festivals are always a great time for kids. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, again, nice to meet you. Bye bye. Nice Say bye, you. Bright. And Bright comes like bye. <laughs> Take care of you two. He goes away. And I'm gonna go away to this. I'll, I'll give the give pay the thing to the goddess. Oh no, the lady. Oh, no. The lady. Oh no. You've done enough damage to me emotionally. Stop. You see Slopa <laughs> coming back with uh, with a smile. Welcome back. Hello. I, uh, before I forget, I met Luna's sister. And. Oh. Stepmom. Yeah. Hmm. Yes. I see she's not here yet, huh? No. Really? Is Luna having any intention to come back yet, or uh, or is she still having a Luna moment? No. Nope. Okay, let's go. Nope. Oh, that's okay. Um, <laughs> well. She's not here yet. Maybe we should reconvene with your parents. I think they might be worried at this point. 
Maybe we should. Then, then we can wait for her at the gates. You know, mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure she can find that. Are you going to search for your parents? Right? Yeah. I'm gonna okay. switch back to Well, the... you find them easily. How sad my bird Lisa was. I get the feeling she's not feeling very back. well. The what? I said I'm gonna switch back to the Lisa color palette. Oh, yes. Before we meet yes. them. And, uh... It was strange. Oh, oh well, welcome like back. I see you have reunited with you. all your friends and you switched one? For another? <laughs> <laughs> Not really a switch, more of a an addition. It's a long. You see, well, Miss Leona needs some time. I guess, I guess it's okay. I, I've heard. Mm -hmm. Anyway, uh, we're probably gonna stay for a little bit more and then go home. So. Uh, if you want to come back, or if you want to just spend more time here, feel free, okay? Okay. I'm just gonna stay here and sit in silence. What antics can I get up to? I didn't even get to buy any fucking books. This is bullshit. Peter, maybe we could get you something to put that syrup on instead of drinking. There is a stand that sells pancakes. Oh, great timing. What Sidor, is a pancake? Stay here. I'm gonna go what? get him a pancake. Okay. Play the pancake. Uh, you want the two pancake service I or the five books. pancake service? How much is each? Two pancakes is uh, five mm -hmm. copper and five ca pancakes is one silver. Ah, five then. Five, okay. You take five sil uh, five pancakes. Do you want uh, a little bit of, of, maple, uh, of maple syrup on top, or would you like them without? Oh, without. Without, okay. You take five pancakes. Okay, I'm gonna take them back to the cedar. Thank you. And okay. just... All right, Cedar. What the hell is that? Open your your syrup bottle. Now pour a little bit of it on these. You spend one serving by doing it. Fine. No. The, the the maple syrup from the good bottle. It's of a golden color. It's so it looks tasty even to 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 glance at it. So I was drooling. Oh. Now eat these. A whistle. <laughs> I eat the pancakes. And the, it's so sweet and beautifully. Ah, it's so good. That's the kind of. Yes, bride. I think he likes it. I don't, I don't, how do you role play like food gas? <laughs> um, anime girl noises. No. Anime girl noises. Anime no. girl noises. Anime girl noises. No, I'm not please, please, girl noises. please I'm do not that. Going to do please that. do that. No. Just, just say you're making the noises and we can imagine. <laughs> we all know. That's my head cannon. See, so is know. definitely making What the noises. hell? <laughs> Yeah, like that. <laughs> <laughs> it's your... oh, yes. <laughs> oh, I love oh. that. <laughs> yeah, I might do that one. For why do I do, Why did I hear that in my head? No, stop. No, I don't think Cedar would do that. As funny as that is. I mean, after Alamantra having an ara ara moment, uh, <laughs> this is this is beautiful. <laughs> You know what? Break it. Let's escalate. Oh no! Oh my God! <laughs> oh, Jesus! This is. You know what this looks like? 
It looks yeah. like where, where when <laughs> like when they take uh, pawn f uh, p p pieces and they like censor it with food, you know, <laughs> no, and put a, a baguette that. or something. It. It's a uh, it's oh, that kind oh. of, of kind of thing. That happens I, for like a single moment. Then the, all the pancakes are consumed like extremely fast, and it just goes back to normal. And everybody just stares. It's just and then silence. I would, I would just like to underline that that's something that Lama said, and La Lama is very horny. No, Lama has just been on the internet for a few days too long. I think a few hours too long. I think a few yeah. years too long. I no, I'm meaning like you need, you just need two hours to get all this shit. That's anyway, true. uh, so you basically see uh, Cedar moaning as a uh, soul away, <laughs> and uh, and 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 using the devour attack to consume the. Um, uh, and then he goes completely the normal, food. like nothing happens. <laughs> he clears his throat and then he leaves. <laughs> He's just gonna sit in a corner of shame. No, I'm gone. He's gone. In all my years, I've never seen someone eat like that before. Avery looks terrified. <laughs> I think I finally saw some passion in his eyes. <laughs> <laughs> I love this. <laughs> See that he's like porn. This is the new. Uh, this is canon now. <laughs> Only Kichu, that. I would, I would say that Kiju is, that. Kichu is impressed and amazed. I'm gonna turn to Kiju like, Hey, do you know how to make pancakes? Excuse me? Do you know how to make pancakes? Yes, I know. Great. Teach me so I can make it to him. Oh, absolutely. Oh. I wanna embarrass yes. him with that. <laughs> he only eats for that. <laughs> for that syrup. Just yeah, gotta, just gotta learn. I would to say that. Syrup. I would say that the the tastiness of that thing was thirty percent the the what thirty percent the pancake and seventy percent the the syrup. The syrup, yeah. But the pancakes, you really liked them. Really liked them. My brain is fried, and so is my dignity. <laughs> yeah, right now, your brain is being swallowed by maple syrup. I was gonna take Lisa to go buy books, but I guess I'm just going to die instead. <laughs> you do not get any books. Nice. I forgot after getting, like, steam, like, pouring out of my ears. Is that a, a a pancake grim? Beautiful. No, that's the guys that possess pancakes. That's a. Anyway, now with Cedar having an orgasm. Oh my god. Avery and Lisa having a. Basically being sad about not getting books, and Noroi is with his family. I'm just. She's just sad in general. Like, the books are sad, but. Everything that just happened fucked up her entire day. He is just sad, period. <laughs> Full stop. Like, we had she enough would love a book right Eat a now, pancake. She's not gonna say, Have hey, go some get syrup. me a book. I spent my fucking money on a cube. <laughs> Have some syrup. Feel better. Feel better, maybe. Maybe it will be... <laughs> Now we're imagining Avery with food gas. I no. 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 I that feels illegal. Refuse. That feels illegal. It is illegal. Ooh. Yes, go to prison. Only Cedar because it was funny. <laughs> Avery just... And because he's the tallest one of us. Yeah, Avery, I bet Avery just eat it and be like, I'm just okay. Right, it's, it's just a normal ass. Because Cedar is normally emotionless. Yeah, for the first time we actually see his emotion, and it's just food. My god. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Oh my god. <laughs> never <laughs> never search the that. Food Wars uh, gifts. Never. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Always that, uh, search the Food Wars That's the mistake. Gifts. Food Wars is... That's the best yeah. thing. 
I don't think Cedar's clothes ceased to exist at that moment. No, it, they didn't. They didn't. Oh, oh no. no. This is good, but it's not that. <laughs> Why not? So. Oh my god, I found the perfect one. I hate I it. I don't like a lot of these. A lot of these are making me feel uncomfortable. Ooh. I found... Does anyone else see the honey one? Yes. Fucking... Yeah. That's, that's, that's yeah. what I imagine Cedar is feeling now. Oh my god. Let's go back to the session, please. <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> okay, everyone's sad. What are we doing? If you want, you can just call it a day and... And no. go to the next day. Hey. That's what I'm planning. Avery is no more will to be at this festival. You know what, sure, I'm gonna go home by myself. <laughs> How long would it take to walk from here to the capital? About three hours. Okay. By walking. If you have a wagon, it what if I guess two hours What if I use wait, one of my wait, invocations wait, wait, wait. as a mount? Uh, you we cannot the keep NPCs. them for more than yeah, one hour, I think. I can summon them again, though. Yes. Uh, no. Can you not? If you expire that hour for the okay. day, they cannot be summoned again. Oh. Hmm. Is it? Wait, let me read it. In the class. Unless I, I forgot to add it back when I fixed it. I don't know. Yeah, let me read it. I just want to make sure. Skills. It would be in... The uh, one of it. It'd be in the art of the location. Uh, I think... So far I've had enough. Yeah. Yeah, same. same. Okay. We can say that you're just going back home, getting each other, your everyone is their rest, and we can just head essentially to the 42nd day. Yep. Well, you, we can, if you want, check which quests are outside, have you talk a little bit, may, perhaps choose one so I can prepare for the next session properly and have the last bit of roleplay. That's up to you. Yeah. Would you All like right. to do that? Mm -hmm. Let's do that. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Avery's back as Avery now. So. You guys go back and they they too go back to to home. Uh, Noro, you reach them at after a little bit and Sopo, Cedar, they're both going back to the uh, Stout Oak and Avery as well. And in her own time, walking back alone, she reaches back to the to the stout oak, locks herself in her room, and stays there for the rest of the day. And then it's the morning of the thirty-second day of fall. Luna. I'd say that you didn't sleep too much. Nope. <clears throat> what are you doing? You're in on your, you're on your bed. Do I know if Shubo's arm should be getting better soon? Shubo's arm is gonna get better about in a couple of days still. It would be, uh, so considering that he, he was hurt in the 38th is gonna be fixed in the 44th so you still have this day and then and, and tomorrow's day it doesn't say can yeah. she stays in her room and it doesn't say in it. unless i missed it uh, okay i probably changed it and, and forgot to add it back but it's okay yeah. you're not staying in her room i think right Yeah, you have more a couple of more, of more days. Actually, three days because you, you he got hurt in 39th. 
not in the 38th. So, uh, you're going to be operative in the 45th. 45th. You're 42nd still. <sighs> so, you have a couple of days. And, um, you're staying in your room. What about the others? <laughs> oh, shit. I am also I staying in my room. Okay. So is going to go down to work. Okay. Uh, you're still in your room. You're gonna hear. You go down. Cedar? Eat normal syrup with normal pancakes and it tastes like ash. <laughs> Surely, okay, surely I forgot his name, but the owner of this tavern should have some good-ass pancakes. Okay, I will tell you. The pancakes that Wilmer does are really good. Yeah. Really good. So. But they, they're missing something. That is, it's just, it's like, my god, it's, it's when you have, when you need 100... And you have 93 or something. You're just there, you know? But not enough. It doesn't It doesn't spark that utter joy. It's beautiful, it's tasty, but it's not that, you know? Mm. So it leaves you with this... It, it, it's cock-blocking you. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh my God. I mean, it this was a good gasm. So it makes sense. This session is so fucking explicit, bro. What the fuck? What's going on? I don't on? care. I just gonna kill. It's past Why? 2 a.m. for me, I don't care. This Fuck is it. amazing. Alright. Gonna get killed by a Filipino woman. The fuck? It was nice meeting you. And, uh, yeah. You see, Silpa, what are you doing? Hello. I am going to Wilbur. Yes. Uh, hello. Hi, hi. How are, you doing? How are you doing today? Oh, great. No. I am going to. Well, our teammate is injured. I don't recall if I told you already or not. <laughs> but we're taking a break from adventuring for a while because of it. And, um. I am going to be off today. Just to uh, head back home to the family for a quick visit. I'll be back either later tonight or tomorrow, but if you see my teammates looking for me, just tell them that I'm in Vista. Okay. Mm -hmm. No, Roy. What are you yes. doing? I'm just in my room. Okay. So you're not meeting up today. I'm talking with everyone. Probably he not. Doesn't plan nope. on it. Okay. Uh, is anyone checking on the quest list today? I will. Okay. Oh, good, uh, good morning. You don't look mm. great, though. Good morning. I never look great, to be honest. No, it's not true. You look great normally. What do you mean? Hey, yo. What? What? She's saying Probably. it like, 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 trying to, you know, cheer you up. Cedar, you're, you're in. I know. You're in, bro. Just gotta make your move. Well, frankly, you look better. Ah, <laughs> uh, you're just flattering me. Anyway, can I help you in any way? Uh, I was going to get the quests. Oh, sure. Let me give you the, the the quest list. We have a couple that have been removed. Mm. 
<laughs> You're not gonna like this. Oh no. Uh oh. What's the? I hope the only one left is the under labyrinth. Come on. Let's see. I. Hmm. Runaway scoundrels, raging boots. Pesky goblins and bellowing caves are the only ones left for the iron quest. For the iron. No, Very sad. Pesky goblins mm. and bellowing cave. I said that wrong. It's fine. We'll get it again. Activities and waste. Someone went into the fuck. Oh no, it's unavailable. Does that has mean... been done by someone else? Okay, as I was about to ask, does unavailable mean they just stopped sponsoring the quest, or if someone else did it? That's what I wanted to ask. Yes, you answered it for me. All right. Thank you, Cordelia. Oh, don't worry! I just, want, I just wanted to, I don't know, keep an eye on this. Do you hear okay. anything about the results of the Raging Beast quest? We heard a little bit about it. We heard that the people that actually um, managed to complete it was none other than the Iron Dice. And they actually managed to defeat the beasts with not too many problems. They reported a couple of strange activities, like one of the beasts seemingly being all-powerful and strange and or you know, like hmm. different in some way, but yeah, besides that, they've managed to done everything with uh, professionally. Surely they don't look the most professional team, but They've done their job well. Yeah, you don't have to worry. Are you sure that you're okay? Mm -hmm. To be honest, I think my teammates are probably worse than me. <laughs> what happened? Did you not enjoy the festival yesterday? Oh no, we enjoyed it. Just, uh, well, we were curious about that hag, and we decided to go oh, no. see. They all kind of got emotionally destroyed? I don't really know how I'm supposed to help them. <sighs> she leans forward a little bit, you know, closer to you, and goes like, For what I know, seemingly she starts saying stuff about people's life even if she doesn't know them apparently some kind of divination magic that she cannot control she acted like her i'm sorry about it fractured yeah it's fine it was our decision I'm sorry, now that I think about it, saying that you shouldn't go there is probably the best way to let you go there. I should not, uh, not uh, have said it. No, no, no. Don't blame I don't know if you were responsible. You probably would have found out about her anyways. Anyway. If there's any or quest this... that you would like to take when uh, when the group is back together... Feel free to, t to tell me, okay? Alright. Well, I would need to talk with them first. Oh, absolutely. If... Do you have any ideas to help a emotionally destroyed group? An idea to, dis to, to help um, an emotionally destroyed group? You know, it's gonna sound very stupid, but the way you see it, 
is the best way to cope with something that is hurting you is to share it. Talk it. Talk about it. Let it out. And mm. perhaps there are deep secrets. Secrets that you don't want to tell to anyone else. Perhaps there are things that are hurting you because... Because there are dark things about your past, or dark things about your life, or those things about anything, really, and I understand. But if you keep everything inside you, no matter how dark it is, it's just gonna eat you alive. So, my advice is to be with them, make them talk, and if they really don't want to talk, Make them feel like whenever they need it, you're there to listen. That will be my idea. Yes. Ah, thank you, Cordelia. You don't have to thank me. I do it because I want to help you guys. Well, then I have to thank you for being a good person. I try. I do my best to... Let's just say, make... Makes people's day a little bit better. I think that's a good, a good, you know, daily task. Each day, try to make someone else's day a little bit better. I hope they do that, at least. I'm sure you've made many people's days better. Thank you. Where are you two being simps? Kinda pauses for a long moment and then says quietly, You sure made mine better. Oh. Ah. <coughs> uh, <coughs> She just looks at you and smiles brightly. Um. Uh, anyways, I I I I better get going. See you. Have a great day, Cordelia. Thank you. Bye I'm bye. going to go back to the stout oak. Yeah. You go going back to <laughs> ship it. Same, and, um, bro. They should put. And uh, Luna, where are you? If you exit um, your room. Uh. Uh, Luna is rough. She's got up. She if. Just in case she runs into any of her party members, she's got her cloak and hood on, and okay. uh, she's leaving. She's just gonna go to West to Westville, uh, back to her family for a bit. Okay. So you have a little bit of a family retreat, okay? Mm -hmm. So, anything else you would like to do or make or, or anything in particular? I want to talk yes. to Wilmer. Oh, you can talk with Wilmer. <coughs> Wilmer, no way <coughs> to make, oh, make extra money. <coughs> That's me. Don't die, Lama. Oh, no. Don't die. Go back in the water. Don't worry, I'll, I'll die. It's it's gonna be okay. <coughs> you go back and uh, I uh, Silpo, what are you doing in the meantime? Any, anything else in particular? You're just chilling there, eating. After after I told him that I'm gonna be heading home, I'm just gonna eat something and. Okay. So I'm guessing by the time Luna is up, I would be have gone. Okay, so you're also going directly to uh, Westfall, right? Yep. 
Okay. So. Let's fall. Let's fall. I forgot we're in the same place. <laughs> and, uh... Ah. You reach there, with, and you see Willemer just happily cleaning tankards and, 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 and the smaller people just helping around, serving the food, etc, etc. Hey, Wilmer. Hello! You know places around here, right? Mm-hmm. Tell me. What are you seeking uh, for? Do you know ways that a person can get, like, extra money like gigs <laughs> extra money uh adventure wise i don't know man i just want something to do <laughs> oh yeah silpo told me something about the fact that one of your teammates is injured so you have to take a couple of days off hmm you want an extra, some extra money? Yeah. Well, something to do while waiting. Huh. I have an idea. Mm -hmm. I actually know the person that might help you. Cool. Disappears yeah, for a moment, comes back with a, with with, um, uh, with an apron and, and toss it at you. <laughs> hey. Come, I'll money. teach you how to cook. Hey. Oh, baby. <laughs> So you're spending your uh, these days with Wilmer. That's cute. I ship it. <laughs> no. Yes, <laughs> Retro. Yes, ship it. This is like when you and your twin who share a room have an argument and both go soak in your room, exactly. <laughs> and uh, the last one I'm going to ask about is Shubo. Anything in particular doing in these days of rest to get your arm fixed? Not really, just staying staying at home, helping out a bit, but mainly just resting. Okay. You hear the knock on your door, and someone goes and, and check who's that, and... Mm -hmm. Should have it around. Well, let me get it back. <coughs> ah. What? Oh. Trevor, Kijo, would you like to make me talk with uh, your son? Come in. And he comes to see you. Oh, um, sir. So... How are you doing with that arm? It's getting better. Mm. You think you'll be able to return to your task soon? Of course. What's it's... the situation? How do you feel like it's going? There was a bit of an argument again, but it should be fine. What about um, the quest system? Have you found any problems with it? Not really, no. Okay, that's what that's what we like to see. Anyway, just wanted to make sure that you are doing great. <laughs> uh, How great can you be in this situation? Mm -hmm. But to be fair, it's not the first time I see someone a little bit broken. And I guess it's not even your first time either. No, it certainly is not. Oof. Anyway. 
Ah, I'm gonna have to train. Go back to training. At least today we are... Well, today. Recently we had a couple of more um, recruits. Oh. oh. And uh, increasing the numbers of guns is... Such a pressing, is pressing issue. To be fair, King Numis is... Is getting a lot of... You know, putting a lot of uh, investment in the... In the sensor, so... Should be able to to reinforce the kingdom and and, and everything with, uh, around linked to its protection. Mm. I funny. hope you are. Um, I hope you are having uh, discovering the right information and you know. Understanding what's this, the, what, what, if these investments are well well put or not, well invested in a, in a way. I'm working on it. Yeah. Anyway, I'll leave you to rest. I don't want to bother you. Thank you. <sighs> it raised up. Uh, it was sitting close to you and. And then just uh, sighs. Is everything alright? Yeah, it is. It's just... The kingdom is strange. What do you mean? There have been a little more quests recently. And seeing you in, this, in these conditions means that either you've been stupid or something that you have thought was particularly strong. And I know that you're not a stupid person. Yes. This thing I thought, it, it was unnatural. Weird. Natural things happen all the time, but usually I'm... they're not of this magnitude. Mm -hmm. Your task is, let's say, updated. Oh. Keep an eye on the quest system as you always do as your task was before keep an eye on things making sure that you know adventurers are doing the right thing and quest makers and sensor are making the right thing as well that is not change it but make sure Try and understand what the fuck is going on with our in this kingdom. Because so many things are going all over the place. So many things are getting more and more crazy. And we don't have the people to face them. Even if we had the people to face them, we cannot investigate on all of it. To At this point, adventures are helping the kingdom much more than we can do. Mm. And knowing that you are among them, well, makes me feel a little bit safer for this for the future of this kingdom. Hmm. Whatever is going on, I want to know. So, if you know anything particular, if you if you meet anything that is particularly strange, I'll be waiting to hear about it. Okay? I will tell you. As soon as I know, I will tell you. Good. And don't be reckless. This doesn't mean that you have to push yourself to do things that are, you know, too hard for you yet. Of course. Grow strong. And then strong. And then stronger and stronger and stronger. Like we always do. <sighs> I 
I wish you uh, a quick healing. Thank you. A good rest. No, Roy. And he just nods to uh, salute and goes away. I salute as well. You can see Kijer just. Well, you don't really see it, but Kijer just looks at him with with squinting. <laughs> And go those away. <sighs> With that being said, we can close session seven of uh, Norman Hurst, mm. The Hidden Wish. Mm. And I'll leave you guys to choose among the quests as we are going to go back to this campaign. During the 45th day of fall, when Shubal is going to be fully healed. So in the days between, I would ask you to send me specifically what you would like to do in, uh, in these uh, in these days. And uh, I will make sure to think about stuff depending on what you would like to do in this in these few days nice. uh, i will ask nice. you to tell nice. me in the end so it's easier to, to get them to get them back yeah okay mm -hmm. also feel free to discuss discuss in the in the general chat like in the not in the general chat but in the class in the campaign chat about the quest you want to make Ooh. because uh, I'm gonna prepare as always all of them. Uh, they're kind of all or already almost pre all prepared. But knowing which one are you going to make is gonna be easier for me to actually prepare the the, the physical thing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So I hope you enjoyed it. That was fun. amazing. So that fun. was really great. That was a conflict. We yeah, love it. I had. Conflict. I had also. First of all. If you if you guys hear Luna's voice when you, with the bird talked to her, yeah. it was all like it was all like gravelly, and that was just because I hadn't talked in so long, <laughs> but it kind of worked. It fit. <laughs> it wasn't it obvious, fit. by the way. Lisa is the form Avery puts on when she wants to be brave. Oh. That's the idea mm. I want so. to take care of. Her. I want to take care of all of the characters. <laughs> just what Everyone the needs therapy. Just what I want I'm to take care. I'm slowly transforming into a detective. Um, so Pod, yeah. his anger issues, and Cedar <laughs> and his Cedarness, and Shubo and everything about him. Right, I'm gonna end it was just concerning in general. And